Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, coming at you live. We're on remote today. We are in Glendale, Arizona, not Phoenix. Talking TV with Nick and Josh. I'm Josh. I'm Nick. I'm Jerome. And once again, we're talking about HBO's limited miniseries, The Night Of, episode eight, Call of the Wild. Go ahead. I know you guys are getting ready to <laughs> shoot a fucking splurge Wait, dick all over a fucking wall here. Is it, so is it really a limited miniseries now that there's talks of season two? Just because there's talks doesn't well, mean there will be. Well, Nas, the guy who played him, yep. hint, hinted. Riz, hinted. I, I watched his whole. Well, uh, I watched his whole AMA on Twitter after this. Um, but he thing. like he hinted that there's gonna be a season two. I sent you the screenshot. And Remember? I, yeah. And yeah. I saw that like they said that they wrote it and ended it the way they did, like almost kind of open ended a little bit on purpose, so they could do a season two. I mean, I I would be fine with it. I'd watch it because it would probably be chasing the CPA guy. Yeah. Yeah, most I mean, likely. You yeah. know what I mean? I mean, what else could it be? Unless yeah. it just totally went like left field and Um I know the other show had a season 2. I don't know if any of the same characters were in it, but I know it was about a girl this time instead of a guy. Wasn't there three seasons in the BBC one, right? There's three? Oh, maybe. Oh, maybe. I, I thought I, I, I heard thought there was only three, two, seasons. but I don't know there could have been. Um Not that it matters. As long as it's not like season 2 of True Detective. Cuz I like that, but I don't think anyone else did. Yeah, I've never seen I, it. I, there was parts of it that I liked, but there was a lot of I was like, oh my god, this is pretty terrible. I heard it was really, it, like... It was just very boring in parts. And then, like, all of a sudden there's like, a very giant, slow. like, 15-minute shootout, and then they'd be boring again for, like, a couple more episodes. Yeah, and I, I liked it. I don't know why I liked it. I think I liked all the actors in it. I think, I think that's part of, part of the reason it could be, like, the actors. Yeah. And actress. I didn't like her. So if they have a season two, do you think, like, Nas and all them would be in it? Or do you think, like... Do you think they would, I would include ass- I would assume they would, him but in, like, just kind of show you how he's, like, getting back to his r- regular everyday life? I bet it would be a smaller well, role. I mean, but yeah, I bet it would be a smaller, too. <laughs> yeah, I I, I, mean, I, that, I was just, you know, he's like doing your crack. guys' opinion. He's do doing you, crack do you on think, the beach. Do you think they'd bring Freddie Brack back, not Brack? Well, being that he's in prison for the rest of his life. Well, uh, not not, not out of it, but, like, they could go back into there and show they him. They could show him. Yeah. You know. I mean, I guess they could. Or like if like someone else involved in the case goes to jail and he yeah picks them up now. I mean if it's or maybe not if, goes if it's back. still called the night of wouldn't they still need to have a night? Of? Yeah, it would. It would. Well, it's, I mean, it, it would still, still be about, talking about, about the, the, night of. the night of. But would it be? I guess that's my question. <laughs> that's a phone ringing yeah. over there. Does uh-huh. it, someone want to go <laughs> answer that real <laughs> quick and hang up? Hello. Um, I don't even know where the phone is. Uh, we'll just move on. Yeah. He probably can't even hear it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> well, All right. Well, so let's let's start while the phone's ringing. Um, yeah. So Box is talking to a couple of cops at the bar. Well, they're talking. Well, they, they they're, were talking, and then they they talked to him. So yeah. I called it Box. Well, he talking. <laughs> but he didn't talk. Like yeah, they, they, they asked him a question, and then he was gone when they panned over to him, didn't he? Yeah, but I, he said something. Oh, okay. Me, I think. I just I thought that little scene was kind of. Uh, funny like just the way like they were talking about oh well a perfect show like oh like yeah. you know that was put in there like intentionally like yeah by the writer <laughs> to, i think it was you know <laughs> you know i got, I got like, a feeling yeah. that like everything in the show is put there intentionally he might be on i don't something. i don't know about perhaps that, but I, I don't know. I know what you're saying. It was ironic. That yeah, it was kind of like, you know, a cop like, show oh, on a cop wow, show. Oh, okay. Like, what if they were talking about a cop uh, show on uh, a cop show on a cop show? I don't know. It would be like Tricop. Tricopolops. But you, I think the point of the scene was that, like, there was shit on his mind. No, definitely. And that's kind of what I was hinting at the end of last yeah, episode last when I asked you guys yeah. about it. Like, yeah. To me, it just seemed like he was, like, something was going on. Like, oh, yeah. He was kind of in doubt and, like. You know. well, he also like later in the episode. I mean, and I, and I think he just doesn't like most people or interacting oh, yeah, with most definitely. people, too. Yeah. But uh, I mean, obviously, as we find out, there definitely was something on his mind. Um, later on in the episode, he refers to his party as awake too. Yes. So I think that had a little to do with it, also. You know, it was you know. He didn't want to retire, which makes you wonder why the fuck he was retired. Yeah, that's well, yeah, a, that's why did I he wondered. retire? Because, I mean, he, he gets a job for NYU. Yeah. Like, he's working as a security guard at NYU. And, like, he could have Like, continued. isn't that the whole point of retiring, so you don't have to work anymore? No, it's to get your pension. <laughs> you know Yeah, I but, mean? I mean, I can just, like, well, Yeah, I thought that was odd, too. My like, fucking mom did the same thing. She retired and then kept working. Yeah, it's like... Because yeah, you get, like, double pay. Well, yeah, I in, mean, in some cases. Right, it makes sense, but it's like... 
I don't know. I feel like that's like the most. That's the re. The reason most people retire. Did, did you I see a ghost? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I was like looking I was down. Try, and I was trying not to like, boo. <laughs> belch into the uh, mic here. <laughs> okay, so then he goes back to the precinct and uh, watches some video. Yeah, is that the is that the, like the this is what they're showing Andrea and he like rewinds it and watches it six hundred times. Yep. Yeah, and he when he stops it, the still frame, she looked pretty goddamn scared. Like when she was turned around, like. Yeah. What like, you mean when she was turned around? <laughs> I, I found it really interesting the scenes with him like investigating stuff like that, like watching the tape and like oh yeah, then, like, like he zooms in. Well, it's just funny and like thing, the like, whole series. Yeah. Yeah, me too. I liked it. I, I like that stuff. Well, and it was funny that, uh, I mean, he basically could have done what he did in this episode <laughs> in the first, in the second episode. Yeah, yeah but we discussed this. Yeah. No, I, I know. He? I yeah. know. I get it. But it's like, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, Just if he has doubt now. Nothing. Never, never barks at anything. Maybe we should put a park car on for an hour. Mm. We could. It's in the drawer right there if you want to go grab it. It'll, it'll make him not bark. But be, Obviously, be, <laughs> that's the whole point of a bark collar. Well, yeah, but she doesn't turn tell, it on. Tell him what. Oh, my God. Okay, so this could be a little story for the podcast while he's getting the bark collar. So the other day, Noah was barking, and I, he was interrupting something. So I came out here to get the bark collar, and I didn't realize that it was still on. Oh, nice. So I grabbed it by the goddamn prongs, and when I was walking the over, prongs? the pr- whatever the things at the end the that prongs? like the, the metal things, yeah, yeah, the prongs, yeah, the prongs. Um, but so he was he was barking in the fucking other room, <laughs> and it shocks my hand, <laughs> makes my arm go instantly numb. I throw the That's fucking. That's a good thing, four a cr- foot mafia video. We, th- will that thing fit around your neck? Yeah, my mom did it. And she, she barked like a little dog. And like she started freaking out and grabbing out her neck because it was. That would be a good four foot mafia video. If, it'll, if yeah. that thing will fit around your there's, neck. There's two. You want to do it with me? No. You it, sure? I guarantee you that will not fit around my fat ass neck. It might. I well, have like a 19 could, and a half just, inch neck. You could just hold it up to your neck and bark because it, it's just on. So you can just hold it there. <sighs> oh my God. If you can put it on your testicles. Mmm. That definitely won't fit around there. He's got 19 and a half inch testicles. Well, we all know that. Is the thing's on? Or does it need to be on? No, it's not. No, he'll, it'll, it, it'll trick him. <laughs> Hopefully. Um, God damn it. I don't know. Do you want to start over or do you want to just keep going? No, let's not start over. Okay. Let's we'll continue. Yeah. Well, because we, we just started. We leave most of that in anyways. Okay. The barking? Yeah. No, oh, okay. You know, the... Um, but where, the, were, where were we? The, we're stor- the store where you <laughs> were holding the prongs? <laughs> yeah, the prongs. <laughs> <laughs> but where, where were we, though? Um, we were talking about um, the footage and the stuff. footage and how yeah. we liked it. Yeah, and then he was saying something, and, then and I was just saying like how he could have done that in episode two. Oh yeah. yeah so true, I mean, true. like, what I was saying is, is like if he if he has doubt now, like you you almost have to know he had doubt in, like from the get go. Yeah, you think so? Cause I mean, you would he think was, if he was I, absolutely I don't certain, know. you don't think anything would change his mind. Like, I mean, especially after you know, I mean, I guess he had to really do some fucking digging to come up with the idea of finding out that it was it wasn't Nas um because he had to go through phone I, records and I all that shit I think he was pretty certain it was Nas in episode 1 No, uh, I think it was I I don't know. I think he was certain, but I feel like if he had, did have doubt now, he had to maybe had like a little bit. He had like a sliver. I don't think he had yeah. much. And then just as more things like stacked up and stacked up, I think he was like, "Oh, maybe maybe this kid didn't do it." Yeah, yeah, and the funny thing is, is it everything else stacked up that he maybe he could have done it, except for like, for box, it was maybe he couldn't have done it. Do you know what I'm saying? Like we thought, like episode two, we we're like, well, maybe you know now he's doing stuff and like I don't, I didn't, I didn't think he ever did it, but I hoped he did. I didn't think he ever did it either, but I kind of, I, I didn't hope he did. I just thought it'd be interesting if he did. And I, I, I did hope- you see Bill Simmons' tweet that I sent you? Yeah. I thought that was pretty funny. <laughs> what, do you, what do you say? Uh, he, he said that he it's was like, hoping that... Uh, what was it? He was hoping that Nas did it and that... Um, they would roll, like, Freddy into Omar and make, like, a uh, wire two or something, yeah. something like that. Where, where is it here? My dream scenario for tonight is Nas is found guilty and then HBO immediately rolls him into Omar 2.0 into an Oz remake. 
Uh-huh. So he like got every everything me, but like Game of Thrones and. <laughs> let me just say, I'm sick and tired of seeing the fucking Westworld fucking trailer. Do you, do, do you not want to watch it? No, I'm just sick and tired of seeing the fucking trailer. Like, fucking show me something else. Holy fucking Jesus. Well, I mean, the trailer before this episode of the trailer was new. Yeah, it was. It was. And it was just like, <laughs> well, this is fucking weird. But it's just like, come on. Like, it's like they're force feeding you fucking. I mean, I don't know. It's just I mean, something it, that it bothered me. I know little series. things bother me, but. Little stupid things. Yeah, little stupid things. I mean, you you don't have to watch it. You could stop. I mean, you're the one that only watches HBO. Like, what other show do you watch? What do you mean, what other show? What other show? Name another show. Stranger Things? Yeah, you watch that on Netflix. Flash? Okay, there's no commercials. Flash, you watch on Netflix. Yep. What other show on TV? Uh, we watch Superstore. Oh, we watch New Girl. Show. Love me some New Girl. When's the last time you watched oh. New Girl? <laughs> the last episode it was on, so probably two months ago. Oh, okay. So, yeah. but did they Superstore have a, about so two months ago, which is returning this month, September. They just had a new something. episode, didn't you just watch it? They had an Olympics episode. Yeah. But that's yeah. it. It's like back for season two, September yeah, like 24th or something. Season two doesn't start for a little bit. But it was there's still a new episode, right? Yeah. I, I think it was just Olympics like a special one. or something. I didn't, I didn't know about it. Yeah. No, but my point was is that you only watch HBO for the last eight weeks. Uh-huh. <laughs> that's all it's you're the see. only show you watch, uh-huh. and you're watching the show that's taking over. You're going to... They're showing the preview for the show that's going to take over for it. Right. You're probably going to see that. No, I know. Well, and then they were they showed Oz like nine times, too. They showed Oz a few times before the episodes, too. Oh, really? I never yeah. saw Oz. Well, I don't watch an HBO Go. Usually, usually I watch an HBO. I didn't even know they showed trailers for shows before. Like, they showed it a few times. Because Abby was like, oh, what's, what's that? Like, that show might be interesting. And I was like, oh, I watched the first, like, three or four episodes. And it was kind of like, eh. Yeah, it got great reviews. Yeah, I mean, I did you watch it? You never saw it? Really? No. Maybe we should start watching Oz. I don't want to watch Oz. I don't want to watch a show about prison. No? No. You say don't it's watch got, Prison it's Break? It's, uh, some no. of the actors, oh, it's I got do, a lot of, it's got a few actors from The Wire. Break. Yeah, no, it's got really good actors yeah. in it. It's supposed to be a good show. And what's that I guy? I have no interest in it. What's that guy? He's the older I, guy? He's that, bald? What's that guy? <laughs> uh, um, <laughs> let me see. Is his name Mr. Vague? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Mr. Vague. Mr. Electric Boogaloo. Oh, my God. Vague. This guy didn't know what electric boogaloo <laughs> was. How has he never yeah, heard that phrase? You're retarded. I've heard the fucking phrase. I well, then why, the fucking did, then why would you? Why were you that? so surprised when it came up? You, you EPMD or whatever. What? 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 The fucking rap group <laughs> that fucking talked about it. What? No. A hip hop. A hip to the hip to the. Don't they talk about that in there? Don't nope. they say electric boogaloo? Nope. Really? Okay. Well, anyway. No, and that's not EPMD. Yeah, I know it's not. It's Sugar Hill Gang or whatever. Right. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I I where the fuck is this show? <laughs> should we just go back to the night of? Yeah, God. We should probably just start yeah. over. It was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> hey, can you call the house? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, I don't know. <laughs> where were we? Uh, I think we're, we're still we're, talking we about the kinda, security yeah, footage. Yeah, left shit. off of the. No, okay, so. Oh, okay, yeah. So like, she looked scared shitless. Like, when, they, uh, when yeah, he finally right. stopped. And it showed the still of like her looking over her back. You know, I'm like not it was creepy. It was like, yeah. oh fuck! Like she looks like she's fucking about Get, ready to poop her panties. She looks like she's getting chased by a murderer. Yeah, it looks like <laughs> she's getting ready to cut a turd in half with her g string. And then, they, then they went to so, like a little flashback to the like first episode. Her getting in the car. Yep. Her going to the house. Them running into those two black guys, and then that leads to the defense, um, calling Trevor to the stand. He was he. I thought his character was funny. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Like he just was like he was good. Yeah, I don't want to fucking talk to anybody. I'm, I'm not gonna. I don't want to answer any goddamn questions. I'm, like I'm guessing that you two didn't, but I like the judge too. Why would you guess I didn't like him? I don't know. I just kind of. I did. I didn't. I, I, I didn't like. I mean, he I was fine up until oh, right. he was fine up until he didn't want him to be deadlocked. And at yeah. that point, I was like, "Yeah, this guy's a fucking cock wagon." <laughs> cock wagon, no, I, we, like cock that, wagon, like, hagamuffin. Yeah, I had no problem with him up until then, and it was just like, "Yep, okay, go fuck yourself." Hope you fucking die of skin cancer with I, a bald I, I head. I never even like that twice about the guy. Oh, because he had a, like a lot of smart ass comments, so I just yeah, I, but I, I thought he was funny. So, yeah. Like a lot of them, kind of, like the I guess the people against Nas kind of did. So I was like, "Oh, he's just one of them." Oh, yeah. I don't think he was against Nas, though. Well, no, but I consider him in that group of people. I think it was against Nas. Oh, I don't at all. I think you... Well, I think like, he, the way he judge. reacted whenever they said they were deadlocked? Well, 
he, he just, about he just he, that deadlock just means they're tied. Like right. he, he doesn't want to kiss his sister. That's all. Well, what? He, no, he wanted to. He he said, "I don't like." He's like, "That doesn't happen said. in my courtroom or whatever." Right. He's being a judge. That's what judges do. I guess I've never met a judge, so you've never met a judge. I'll be no. the judge of that. <laughs> I've never met like a legit judge. Well, I mean, you so. never interacted with a judge. Like you didn't have a divorce. Yeah, and I didn't go to court because my fucking cunt ass ex wife. Oh, right. Hey, how's your child support going, by the way? <laughs> yeah. She told the judge wow. that uh, she didn't know where I was, didn't have my phone number, didn't know where I worked. So, yeah. Huh. So, no, I've never interacted with a judge. Well, maybe you so. should have. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, maybe. Um, no, uh, they're just. I mean, if anybody wants to loan me like $5,000 <laughs> so I can hire an attorney, yeah, what, what I would appreciate what it. What a donation page to the bottom of the We should. We should start a GoFundMe page for Hess to get a lawyer. To yes, fuck your. Children will be fucking 18 by the time. And they'll be great. You get enough money. So we should start a GoFundMe page. Yeah. I'll start doing stupid C- videos. Comment, comment down below if you want has to do stupid things for you. Yeah. To donate to him. Whatever. He can make He'll put a bark clap. collar on his testicles. And I would. If somebody it. would give me $5,000, are you kidding? No one's giving well, you Well, maybe they'll give you like, I know. They'll give you a couple bucks, but like multiple people will maybe. Yeah. That's yeah. fine. And then I'll get content out of it on 4 for Mafia. Perfect. There you go. It's a win-win for everyone. Yeah. Everybody comment down below if you want that to happen. Comment below. Share this shit. Tell your friends what do they want to see. I'm a big white man. Yeah, you've lost me. You know, yeah. sometimes I wonder what goes on in his head. I do not want to know. <laughs> so, yeah. So, back to the cock wagon? No. Um, well, you started if, it. If you had a nickel for every time you've said that. I'd have one nickel. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> um, No, actually, it was Trevor that we were talking about. I right. asked if uh, you yeah, like yeah, a yeah. judge. Yeah. And, and then... Yeah, and then I talking kinda... about child support and well, testicles yeah. and testicles and mm-hmm, mm-hmm, videos. Mm-hmm. And That's usually how our yeah. No, yeah, I, I mean it's just you were saying that you like Trevor. I do. I thought it was you funny. wanted to blow him all the way back since the wire. No, it's just a complete. I feel like Wasn't it's a completely. No, never really. I think it was like sixteen, bit. seventeen. That's okay. He, um, looked, he looked eighteen. Yeah. Oh, okay. He acted eighteen. Um, yeah, but it was like a compl- it was just a completely different character. I'd never seen him in anything else. So oh yeah, he was like a he was more of a punk bitch in this one than he yeah, was in the wire. Definitely, it, uh, Bodie would have beat the shit out of this mm-hmm. guy. And uh, and he dressed like uh, like he didn't dress like Bodie from the wire. I don't even. Remember I mean, what he wore. It was, I mean, I mean, he no, was in, he, he was in court, like, so he, he had like a like button a gang- up shirt yeah, on. He didn't look and, like a gangster. Or anything. Yeah, and he it was just weird not seeing him with the do rag on too. It was funny though how he was like, uh, no, I, I think I'm gonna use my. Uh, First Amendment, and then or what, and then he like looked at the judge and does like, no, you better. He's like, it. so you're telling me <laughs> you, and then he like used some analogy, and he's like, well, no, and he's like, then answer the question. Well, yeah, because you want to incriminate yourself. That's why you right. That's why you don't speak. So he goes, so you're going to incriminate yourself? He goes, no. He goes, then you better answer the question. Um, but. He was good though. He was he was funny. He was like, I don't know. He was like a little levity, you know. Yeah. He didn't take him too serious. He didn't do anything wrong except cause not. <laughs> what do you call him? Like That's a, funny because he was annoyed by the like the whole situation, but he put himself in. The oh way. yeah, he made it a hundred thousand times worse. Yeah. Yeah, which happens a lot. In the show or with him? just no, I mean in life, people uh, do that shit all the time. Yeah. Um. So and then and then next uh, the funniest part was when he's like they asked him about Dwayne Reed and he's like yeah could you maybe have that <laughs> yeah. name and he's like just goes in this big tirade that was about funny. it um, so which leads into the defense calling him up which because the prosecution doesn't talk to Trevor they don't talk to any of these witnesses right they don't yeah yeah every time she's like I don't know Hagamuffin was like no so then they called. Dwayne Dwayne Reed up and, and then he, he was in prison. Yeah, but I was like, yeah. oh, they just at uh, first I was like, are they really not going to explain like anything about what happened? And they're like, yeah, oh no, he got arrested he getting did. a TV. And I was like, oh fuck, that's so stupid. <laughs> really? I, I didn't like that. I'm like, oh yeah, he just got arrested stealing the TV. Still don't know what happened with those fucking floodlights. Oh yeah, the UV lights. The UV lights. Yeah, yeah whatever. Yeah. That, that that annoys me so much. Yeah, I didn't I, like that. That didn't bother me. I don't give a fuck. I don't think they played any. Roll in it. I well, mean, then why did they show it to us? I don't know. Why do they fucking show you a fucking anything? Yeah, but like, it, there's all kinds of little it, things. They, there is so much that don't are, mean shit. Yeah, but there is so much time put I'm on. I'm surprised it doesn't he bother w- you. You're the you're he like went on the a whole guy fucking getting... chase. And then, no, no, I, 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 the 
that's the part that bothers me is that that's he was, was like chasing. That's what he's talking about. You, talking no, about. you said the UV lights. The UV uh, lights don't bother in, me. That was included with they it. F- they flashed the UV lights and at then the it's end just, of the chase. And yeah. then it's just over. But that's how they started the episode, and that was about his feet. The UV lights were about his feet. Yeah, but I was, know that. I was including that in the it, chase. What's, what's it your just, point? It just flashed the lights, and then it was yeah. over, and then that's it's, nothing it, else. It went from chase to feet. We didn't understand. We didn't, we didn't, why, why didn't they catch him? <laughs> I, I, that's what I'm saying. I, I guess he know. just went home and fucking did his shit to his feet because he didn't want to chase the guy. That's how I took it, but... Yeah, I just don't know why they put any of that in there. They never, ever Because it was just one back. of those things that, for whatever reason, I didn't. it didn't really, like... I'm not like fuck. I, I, I was just I like, why, why, why that? put that well, in you there? You said that motherfucker's just in the wind. I guess next episode. Well, yeah. So I mean, just, that's I, all we knew. But I mean, well, that's what I mean. So it did bother you at the time. Well, I'm, but I mean, it's not like to the point where I'm just like, God damn it! I wonder why they fucking showed us the damn UV light at the end of the episode. But no, you're missing his point. It's not my, the my, UV light. My, my point is why they show. Why, why, why did they show him chase him? Like make it. It was like a five have, minute thing. He gets the end. Like he pulls up a fucking pipe. And then that's it. We don't see anything right. after that. Uh, I, I get what you're saying. but It was the chase, not the UV lights. Okay. The UV lights was just the end. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, this guy's been arrested 13 times for burglary. Yeah. <laughs> Seven times he assaulted the people with a knife. At From their house. From, from their, their house. house. Yeah. That's got to put a little doubt in the juries. I mean, yeah. that's all you need is a little, right? I mean. That's, yeah. what, that's what they kept saying. So, okay, quick question. When you have a jury, say, okay, <laughs> that wasn't quick at all. <laughs> quick question. Let me just pause for like a minute. <laughs> um, when they have a jury, okay, I know they were deadlocked six six. Is it majority or does it have to be twelve zero to convict? Someone? Doesn't mean Taylor we're talking about. Oh, I don't know which one would be. I would, see, I, I was under the impression it had to be twelve zero. I th- I was thinking it had to be twelve zero for and then for because murder. I was talking to Abby and I go I go if one person fucking thinks he didn't do it, like he'll get off. And she was like, "I don't, I don't know about that." Like, I thought it was majority or something. And I, I was f- like, "Because I, f- I remember watching I Twelve like, Angry Men, like in high yeah, school." Yeah. So I thought it had to be twelve zero, but I mean, Twelve Angry Men was made a fucking long time ago, so they could have changed the laws. I have no idea. But if someone knows the answer to that, why don't you just look it up? I could comment below. We're too lazy. Just comment below. Why do you have fucking finger nail polish on your fucking finger? Oh, I, I got drunk the other night, and then I fell asleep. You're such and, a they, and then you slept with me. Well, because they're fu- apparently they put flour on my face too and all kinds of apparently, shit. I didn't know so, that. Oh, you didn't know that? No, it wasn't on me when I so woke he, up. He passed out out here, mm. and I went to bed because I was just tired, and and n- no one was doing anything. So I, I like lay down. I thought mom was coming to bed with me. No, nope, but it was just me, big boy. <laughs> well, no. So then, so I'm like half asleep. Yeah, I scared you too. Well, all of a sudden, he comes flopping in the bed. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> and I'm like, I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? And he's like, oh, they're fucking with me. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, all right. I, but I was tired. I'd been, you yeah, know, it's like midnight. Yeah, me and too. Like, You're like, cool. I, was get, I woke up with them. Fucking leave me alone. I thought they were bed. like spoon, like feeding me some shit in my mouth. Apparently, they're trying to put lipstick on me too. Uh, <laughs> but I woke up with them. You know stick, they have fingernail they polish were, remover? They were sticking shit in my mouth. I'm, I'm lazy. I don't care. I don't need to be right. a camera or anything. Wow. But right. they were uh, they were putting something in my mouth when I woke up. I was like, "What the fuck?" Do you are know what the, all you what the funniest part is? What? So so you run into the bedroom and, and flop into bed. Mm-hmm. And her and Brian were giggling because they, they yeah they didn't think I knew. I walked in there and I saw her. Like oh whatever. And I closed the door. Yeah. Well, so they're like uh, he's gonna come out or like so they yeah they were like, waiting for me and nothing happened. Yeah. And they or they or they waited for me to come out. Oh really? Because they didn't think. So I was like, "Yeah." Taylor told me the next morning. She was like, "Yeah, we're waiting for you. Come out." And she's like, "Did you know Dad was in there?" I go, "Yeah, I saw his feet on the bed. And I just <laughs> laid down. He was either sleep with him or get fucked with by you guys." Right. We cuddled. Yeah. Um. So yeah. So Dwayne reads a dick. It, it was pretty funny though. Well, he like took no responsibility for anything. Oh, well, would you? No, like, I I mean, just, it was just funny because like, he was like, like, like playing it off like it was a I, fucking joke. Like. He's like, I call it trespassing. Yeah. Well, fuck, he's got nothing to lose. He's yeah. the, you know, lifetime criminal. Although she did make a good point, and she's like, um, she's like, you know, that would be your mo, and he's like, I guess. Yeah. Like, like he helped her, but like I don't even know if he knew or cared if he helped her. Uh, yeah, and he could have just said, "I fucking did it." The fuck does it matter to him? Well, he's not in there for life. <laughs> There's a well, lot. <laughs> no, I know. But he's in there. You know what I mean? Yeah, but like, yeah, that's a big difference. So, and then once again, they don't. The prosecution doesn't interview them. What the fuck was that? <laughs> <laughs> I think that was a growl. <laughs> it's like a goddamn monster walking around <laughs> this house. Which is funny. Speaking of that, <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh god. My god! Just real quick. Yeah. Last night, I took my daughter to softball practice. Mm-hmm. I got home. 
Okay, Abby was in bed, and she it's the our bedroom's upstairs, so she's she was laying in bed. The fucking entire house was pitch ass black. Okay, so I sneak into the house. I can just picture you <coughs> sneaking. <laughs> I know. How was I'm a sneaking? pretty quiet big man. Okay. Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> they call me fucking fat ninja. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> who, um, <laughs> who calls you fat ninja? Everybody. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, that's so his YouTube channel. <laughs> so. <I'm laughs> What's everybody fat ninja here? <laughs> Can't you see him doing that? <laughs> yep. Hey, what's going on, everybody? <laughs> you gotta change the name fat of the podcast. Talking to you, fat, fat ninja and Nick. <laughs> I think I just gave myself a nickname. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck me. Woo! So, anyways, I get like halfway up the stairs and. The dog hears me. <laughs> You're not a very bad ninja. <laughs> he just got to call himself a ninja. So I got up the stairs and the dog <laughs> heard me. Halfway. <laughs> Halfway up the You're stairs. You're a shitty ninja. <laughs> Halfway up the stairs is pretty goddamn impressive. <laughs> Talking to get past a dog. Uh, I can't even walk up to your... I can't even get <laughs> on your driveway without fucking true. Joey and oh, well, that's true. Ross going fucking ape shit. So he was like a half whip. And it's like I said, it's fucking stark ass black. Like it is fucking like you can't see shit. So I I see the dog's like silhouette and she was like at the top of the stairs and I just went <laughs> scared the shit out of the dog. She started fucking barking and like charging me <laughs> and then Abby screamed <laughs> like there was someone in the house that wow. she had no idea like it was like a legit like scared to shit <laughs> fucking scream it was fucking hilarious uh did you get in trouble for that no oh, okay. she was like you fucking scared the shit out of me <laughs> i was just laughing that's pretty funny oh god fat ninja so we gotta start calling him fat ninja now you should put that in the description. I will. Oh, God. I'll uh, change my Twitter handle. <laughs> <laughs> fat, fat, I'm sure Fat Ninja's taken. I'm positive. Fat, 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 fat Ninja's not. <laughs> yeah. I don't want to be Fat, Fat, Fat Ninja. <laughs> no, I don't think I'm that big, but... I mean, I'm a big, but... Where were we? Oh, so Jesus Christ. they were interviewing Dwayne. This is going to be the longest podcast <laughs> in the history. It really is, because yeah. we're already at, like, 96 minutes. Well, no, we're not. <laughs> um... So, okay, so they they get done interviewing Dwayne Reed. Not Fat Ninja. <laughs> yeah. Oh, fucking Jesus. So then um, Stone leaves, and she's like, you're going to leave me alone with the Undertaker? He's like, you'll be fine. And uh, as she starts to interview that guy, he goes to the stepdad's uh, work and subpoenas him. But, like, they show her interviewing the Undertaker first. Which basically they they show that like he's had two aggravated assaults on his wife. One was with a knife. Yeah, but and then he was like, but not like we're back together and like. Yeah, she's like, oh, that's a pretty forgiven wife. Yeah, and like she, he and he seemed pretty smart, like with his law too. Like, yeah, there was that one part where he was like, he said something. Well, because she have to answer that or something. She said, um, she's you scare me back after we talked before. He's like, you're honored, and then they took it out because he said that. Which the prosecution didn't even object. Yeah. Usually it's the prosecution that would object in that situation. Yeah, it's it has to be a unanimous 12-0 to convict. Oh. Uh-huh. So, I mean, it wasn't even, like... Close. Yeah, close, yeah, like... That's, so I was right, because that's why I was... I'm like, he's going to get off on... The jury's going to... I mean, there's going to be at least one fucking person. See, and the whole thing with the judge thing is they're they got they're in charge. they got to be... they got to have... they got to keep everybody in line, everyone... And then you don't fuck with the judge. So, no. So when he I says... Mean, you also don't fuck with the Jesus. This is true. Um, so, but w- or Fat Ninja, <laughs> you can fuck with Fat Ninja. <laughs> you don't fuck with Fat Ninja. Um, so, but so like him saying, I don't like to hear that word in my courtroom. It, it's just he wants them to k- talk it out, right? Well, and it's understandable because I mean, and this is a little bit about that, but like that Friday, I'm assuming he's like, okay, everyone, enjoy your weekend at the beach house. No electronics or anything. Like, yeah. So like they were sent to just like figure it out, like. No outside world contact, like no fucking phones, Falcon. No, <laughs> no Falcon no phones. Falcon phones. No fucking phones and uh, no, you know, TV or anything like that. Like that would be a shitty ass fucking little trip. Like I don't know, it might be kind of cool, but I mean, <laughs> <laughs> just talk himself out of it. Yeah, that would have been terrible. <laughs> Second thought, that would have been back pretty cool. I mean, I don't He's know. He's the contradicting fat ninja. <laughs> yes. 
<laughs> we got a whole new channel coming here, guys. Oh, my uh-huh. God. Yes, sir, Bob. We could add Fat Ninja. That could be his name when he does his Fat theory show. Fat Ninja. Oh, welcome, back to, welcome back to Theories of Fat Ninja. <laughs> He's dressed up as a ninja. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Coming at you live from Phoenix, Arizona. This is Fat Ninja. <laughs> Fat Ninja. Oh, my goodness. That could be my intro right there. Fat Ninja. I could talk like... Okay, you're cool. <laughs> <laughs> I could talk like... You're Adam. good. We don't need an intro. We're halfway no, like, through. Like Adam Carolla. Uh, that didn't sound anything like I know. Adam. I'm, you know. <laughs> I don't have a clue. Anyways. So, Stone goes to the stepdad's um, work. Grabs him in the alley. Says yeah. if you threaten my kids again, I don't work out. I'm going to send someone after you from New York. Yeah, he's like, I don't work out he enough. He's totally to... talking about Tony Soprano. Really? Not well, not. if originally this that, that was supposed to yeah, be yeah, it was Tony supposed Soprano. to be yeah. Oh, uh-huh, true. Yeah, I've, that would have been like a little. Oh, he's calling Paulie from New Jersey or something. I don't know. Although, do you think they would have like made him say that line? Because he's yeah. pretty he's pretty big. Oh, no, that's I, I think true. he could have beat the stepdad's <laughs> ass. <laughs> that's true. Yeah. That's I don't think point. he would have needed to call anybody for that. Well, maybe he would have been tired because he was out of shape. Maybe they would have made maybe. him lose 80 fucking pounds for the role. I Jesus doubt it. Christ. You never know. They fucking make people gain weight and all that shit. They didn't make like Chris Farley lose weight. To well, that all. Riz, uh, Nas's character, he said that they shot this in eight months. He said he shot the original pilot three years ago, and then they shot the rest of it over eight months, and he said that it was like hard because he would have to... Bulk up and then like get scrawny again. Yeah, it's and, easy. Like, bulk it, up. It's easy for sc- someone him, for like him yeah. to do it. You know, I don't think um, James Gandolfini. Are you Are you guys excited to see him in Rogue One? I'm just excited for Rogue One. Period. Yeah, yeah. me too. But I, I, I don't I know. Be I don't. I don't. Know, I don't know if he'll have a prominent role. I have no idea. Like, yeah. I mean, like I know, he, he's barely been in the trailer, so I don't know. Yeah, they just show that I'm, one little. I mean, scene they barely show like anything in the trailers. He dies. But you think so? Doesn't everybody die? If he's a good guy, he dies. Well, I mean, technically, their whole team probably should die. Don't they say that like, the people who got the Death Star plans die? Yeah, I think so. Thanks for running it. <laughs> well, you've seen Star Wars, fucker. Yeah. Once. I mean, they could they could stretch. Like, oh, yeah, they died like four years. A- like, they could. Vegas, so there's definitely more. Yeah, that's for sure. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So he subpoenas the dad, and then they both show up at court the next day. I assume it's the next day because they're in different clothing. Yeah, they did a lot of that. Like, oh, here's a courtroom, and then like they show like a little scene, and then back yeah. to that. Um, so and then they call the, the stepdad to the to the well, to the <laughs> stage, to whatever they fucking call him. The to. stand. Yeah. Um, and and basically he's just a fucking weasel. But like by the time they were done interviewing him, you knew he wasn't him. Yeah, well, yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Well, because I was always already worried about this other shit the box right. saw. But. I mean, they they just basically. I mean, he's just a money hungry fuck. Yeah, he's just. But a he wasn't piece a murderer. Of shit. Yeah, 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 basically. Um, but I, she did say at the end. She said, um, "Did you know that she changed the locks?" And she's like, "No, I haven't been there." And he goes, oh, "She didn't," which means he still has a key to the house. Well, and this whole uh, this, that was her funny way of saying this that. episode really showed how green Chandra was. Oh yeah. Like, because she made. Multiple multiple mistakes like this episode. You gonna give us a for instance, or are you just gonna say <laughs> multiple? You don't think so? No, yeah, I, uh, probably. Oh, I, I, mean, I know one for sure. Yeah, putting Nas on the stand. Yeah, I mean, and then uh, just the way I don't know. I guess the way that she she didn't know what she was doing, but I mean, yeah, right. She told the, and like the I don't know. I mean, I, I guess. I guess that might be the only one. I'm sure there was more, but I was kind of fucking with you. Well, no, but I'm just saying, it, like that's the girl, Sh- right? yeah. Chandra, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Chandra, okay. Chandra, the, whatever. The tweet, the tweet like her. Yeah, yeah. she likes yeah. anything that has to do with the night of. Yeah, which I was kind of, I thought it was kind of shitty the way her character just kind of burnt. Like, burnt. yeah, she's done. Like, I did too. You know what I mean? Like, I get why it happened, but it was just like, she played such a good role, I thought. She, yeah. And then I she just, like, disappeared. Well. I mean, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, it had an R. Like, but yeah. Yeah. Was it Noah's? But, no, it was Bob's. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, I mean, she. It just, it sucked to kind of see her come that far to get so close to getting him off of herself. And then. <laughs> I think she might have got him off. <laughs> and then. You know, but I mean, I, but I mean, I it, feel was, like, it was her fault. Yeah, I know. I, I agree, but 
I also feel like he just felt bad for because she liked his tweet. Yeah. No, I feel like it was. I mean, it, it had to be. We, we knew Stone had to do the fucking. Uh, What's like the, the thing? Like the speech at the, the end. The final yeah. speech or whatever. What do they call it? I Closing fig- argument. I yeah. figured he would at some point be up there for I something. I mean, he killed I, it. Like I, didn't, he, I, I didn't think I didn't think that. I had like an out-of-body experience during oh that. God, I thought he was going to say just now. <laughs> yeah, like, just oh now. God, I, wouldn't fucking I was surprise. standing like, over there. Like, I, was, <laughs> I flew out. I was fat Jesus. <laughs> fat Jesus. Fat Jesus. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Holy shit. I've <laughs> never referred to myself as fat Jesus, but okay. <laughs> I'm not ninja, but that might be better. <laughs> Fat Jesus might be better. You'd have to get a big beard, though. I can't grow a beard and for sandals. shit. Sandals. Oh, God. And like I could do sandals. Like a robe. And then we'll nail you to a cross. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> <Might get some, laughs> yeah, That'll be part of the money. Moves. People will pay for that. Yeah. People pay for my surgery. We go up to Home Depot, grab some fucking boards. <clears throat> yeah. Fucking. <laughs> fucking boards. <laughs> fucking boards. All right. Are we, are we back here yet? I think so. Okay, so... And then I, once again, Hagamuffin, no. Doesn't questions. it sound like she has like, uh, like a Werther's hard candy in her mouth when she speaks? <laughs> I thought it was your dick. <laughs> like just like <laughs> little, little tiny. <laughs> no. And she kind of like. I don't uh, think she talked like that once the entire. She kind of like. No, no she used mumbles. Oh, God, she drives me nuts. She's yeah. a great actor though. Actress. <laughs> actor. How many times you do? God, that would be terrible. You know, I was pretty good. <laughs> she was fucking terrible, <laughs> but I like the actress. No, she was a good actress. She played her role because I know that. I I hope that's not how she speaks in real life. <laughs> I I, be, I, I bet, I it, bet is. it is. It's Elaine Elaine Day's kid. That's who she is. <laughs> well, that makes her not talk like that. Okay, yeah, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Mm, Do you? Any, anyways, <laughs> I don't know who that is. I don't know who uh, Elaine Day is. Okay, anyways, let's just move on. No, who's Elaine Day? She's a fucking actress. From who? Who was she in? <laughs> she was in. You like, don't even know, do she you? She was in like Gone with the Wind or something. <laughs> Gone with the Wind. Or something. He had no clue. That's probably not even her look name. At, look at his smile. She invented you chicken nuggets. I bet. Me. Oh my god. That was Robert C. Baker. Okay. Oh, he remembered, huh? <clears throat> was, was it Home Run Baker? I get shitty service here. What the fuck? Oh yeah, it's terrible here. She'd be on her Wi-Fi dildo. Her Wi-Fi is a dildo. Yeah, it's a yeah. giant dildo. Okay. Huh? She gets good reception in her vagina. Well, here, go to the next thing while he's looking that up. <laughs> looking what up? <laughs> her name. Or whoever, whoever oh, and they said licking. Oh, no, he's not looking at anything. Um, so, mm. settle <laughs> down. It sounds like you're pooping. Trying to get on the Wi-Fi here. I'll just let you put the password in, okay? I'm not putting shit in. You know, it's oh, not, a, it's not, that, Im- know it's, it's not that important. We can just move <laughs> on. <laughs> I know. It is that important. I'd like to have service. I mean, what if I want to look something up later? I'll go, it'll probably take maybe you this long and it won't I matter. I know. Maybe we could just get <laughs> There would be no point. <laughs> Did you just start Here, talking. Do, do your thing now. Oh, my God. Okay, Jerome. Start, start talking. Uh, okay, I don't remember where we were. Let's talk to you. We were talking it. about Hagamuffin, and she did her speech for yeah, the candy no, in her mouth. Yeah, like... Uh, okay, so then the next scene, um, um, Box is watching the video with... Uh, what's the victim's name? Andrea? Yes, Andrea yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, she comes out of they come. She comes out of that restaurant, and she's arguing with, with the guy... It's Ray, the accountant, but the, but they don't show his face. Yeah, but I was I was like trying to look look in the reflections to see who it was. Cause I mean, I was like, oh, sure. like I, like I was, Rising Sun. I was pretty sure it was him, but like, cause like when he walks out, you can see it like briefly. But I was hoping that they were like positive. That's how they. Do you it. remember the movie Rising Sun with Wesley Snipes and Sean Connery? Mm-hmm. Mm, no. Oh, they did so. something. It was like it's like. 15 years old and then like, they take a reflection and then they, they enhance way it. Way older than 15 years old, didn't it? I don't know. It's not that big of a deal. <laughs> he doesn't look that big. Hold on. When did Brazen Sun come out? <laughs> no, I just, I, I feel like I was a I, I kid. Was, I was just guesstimating. I got, I got you, I got you. But they enhance like reflections and do all this mm-hmm. like computer shit that you're like, what the fuck? But they can probably do all this shit. Yeah, I just, I just did a podcast with you and then you told me who it was. What? You said last week or the week before who the, who the person was. Oh, oh. No, but I mean, in the movie, like yeah, in, in the know. killer, yeah. Um, but so yeah, so like it's, and then he goes to the restaurant and asks the guy for the credit card information and kind of bullies him into giving the information. Yeah, kind of. He's like, "Oh, you see this? This would be a C or whatever." He yeah, said. it was um, their health health rating or whatever. Mm-hmm. Um, oh yeah, he was like, "You see this? He's this not even your, a cop this anymore." Is, yeah, this will be your subpoena. Which I mean, it shows he knows how to get shit done, but also shows that he doesn't. He just wants to get what he wants, like. But he's doing it for Nas, so like I don't care. 
Yeah. Well, he's not really doing it for nods. He's doing it. Well, he is, but he isn't. He, well, he's doing it because he doesn't want like, the wrong person to go away, I think. Right. And he wants to be right, I think. Yeah. Because right now he's wrong. Yeah. That's true. You know, a little. Like, I don't think that's 100% did, like did accurate. You like, when I, I, think what, I think Drum was right when he said that he doesn't want to walk away, like, knowing that he put an innocent man behind bars. Like, and that's his final yeah, like, chapter he, in like, his he, he career. He wants to end it being like, I did this. I found out who it was. Yeah, I fucked case. up at the yeah. end. Yeah, totally. Um, like, do you think if he was 100% certain um, that it was Nas and, like, he didn't do all this other shit, he'd be fine with retiring? Yeah. Well, maybe not fine with it, but he wouldn't be, be a little more. He wouldn't be at, hanging out twenty four hours a day at the fucking precinct. Yeah, watching videos and all that shit a thousand times. Yeah. So then it shows Nas is pre- pretty much down to crumbs, um, on his drug paraphernalia. Yeah. Um, and then it shows Chandra talking to Stone. She wants to call Nas to the stand, and Stone's like, "You're fucking crazy. Don't fucking just do it. Just convict him now if you do that." And then she's like, "Well, what do you or what do you know or something like that? Who are you?" Because he says, "She." He basically tells her she doesn't know what she's doing, and then she's like, "Well, who are you?" So they kind of get into it. Yeah, a little bit, but like he, he's he, like, he, "You're he, killing me, but you're gonna be killing him. I can get over it." Yeah, yeah. I mean, because he does know more than her, and she knows that she's just well, she was cocky because she thought that she was like this, you know, big octopus in the whole <laughs> land of the sea. No, she just got cocky. I feel like that's yeah, no, why. I, like, I feel, I feel like too. she just got cocky and, you know, she's you think like, it, you think I'm going to do it my way. You think way. it's because she's cocky? Like, I, d- I never got the vibe that she was cocky before. No, I never got a vibe that she was cocky. I was but just, see, I also, I also view it as, and I could be or do you completely think it was like, wrong. Or do you think she was just, it was out of desperation? I think it was, she's cocky, but then also a little bit scared that. Because she's fallen for Nas, and then yeah. he's going to be get, get put away. Exactly. I think and that she... Fall. Yeah, that's, that's what I meant by the, the I think that she sees oh, okay. that she can tell from just speaking with Nas that he didn't do it. And, like, she believes him. So I think she is like, well... He wants to put out all the stops, even if they're Wouldn't the jury wrong. believe him, too? Like, if I believe him... Yeah, like, I can see that, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know, maybe... Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Just because... I mean, and it's funny how he's, like, a completely different person. Like, I mean, obviously, when we first met him, like, he seemed really nerdy. Seemed like a goody two-shoes. Like, he never got in trouble. Was, you know. And then the more and more you find out. But, like, he becomes a completely different person in prison. Yeah. But when he's on the stand, like, it's almost like he's back to that, like, the the guy we met in the first episode. Kind of, yeah. A little bit. He's like, those, just very, he's, like, he's calm, those, demeanored, like... He's got those Bambi eyes going. And he's got, yeah. like, black fucking eyes. Yeah, like, he's, he's like... It's like, holy jeez. I was blinking my eyes for those yeah. that I can't see. Uh, um, everybody. Besides us. Yeah, they they also. It, it was a joke. Oh. Um, so then she goes to talk to Nas, doesn't listen to Stone, mm. and was like, I want you to testify, big guy. And then he goes... I want you to do something for me. And he's like, but he needs it to get on the stand, basically. Like, it's, she's bringing him drugs. He needs them. Or he's going to look like a fucking dope fiend on the stand. Yeah, right. Well, and the thing is. So she's stuck now. Kind of. If she wants him to do this, she's going to have to do this. And she thinks to get him off, she's going to have to do this. So then she. Goes to the pharmacy, buys a condom, yeah. goes to the corner. Yeah, get some drugs. Get some drugs. Gee. Shoves them in her crotch. I like how she shoved them in her crotch. No. Oh. But what did you like? Would you like? Well, we have to get you? back to the scene where she took them to him. I think we are. Is that? We're, no, we're not there yet. Oh, okay. okay, that's what I thought. That's oh. why I didn't say anything. I, mean, I don't know. Um, <laughs> I don't want to jump the gun. <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time. You know. <laughs> um. So Box meets up with some dude. His name is John. I don't even remember that guy. He goes, hey, John. Um, oh, hey. He was a security guy. that hey, used to, He used to be a Well, he cop. works. He's security now, right? That's what I, yeah. yeah. That's what security guy means. <laughs> um, <laughs> so then he wants to get information. He wants to get information without a subpoena for him. He's, he's like, like oh, I'll, well. I'll start packing for jail now. <laughs> yeah. He's like, no problem. But he goes and gets it for him. So I mean, they must be like old friends or some shit. Well, I took it as that he used to work with him at the department, like with Box. Yeah. 
Yeah. yeah. And they were just, you know. And they were, were boys. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of like how on The Wire in season one, when they need those fucking phone records, they, and they go to that oh, guy no. that used to be in the police, and he's like in charge of some phone company. They're like, hey, yeah. we need this from Philadelphia, but we need With, to get it from uh, Lester? Yeah. yeah. It was Lester and. Uh, Carver or. No. Punxsutawney. It wasn't. Another black, it was the other black cop. It, I, wasn't if it? I remember right, it. W- I can't even fucking think of his goddamn name. It wasn't name. a groundhog, if I remember right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, well, I'm not what's sure. The other black cop that we like, not Carver, but the. Bunk. No, the skinny guy. He's a, he like always goes undercover. Sidner. Sidner, yeah. I think it was Sidner. He's and good, you know, he's only watched it four times. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well. I can tell. Yeah. Anyways. Uh, no, but that's what it reminded me of. Totally. Like. Yeah. Like someone like that. Just like. You know, someone who can ask for a favor. Yeah. And they'll do it, won't ask any questions. Right. <laughs> no matter what the consequences are. So, here's your scene. She brings him the drugs. She's got something in her bra and then something in her vagina. Hands her hands him a pill. Now, my, imper- my impression... Or in person. My impression was that they were methadone pills. I don't know if that's true or not. They might have meant. I think they did say that, didn't they? <coughs> Something like that. Like to just kind of well, try to wean him off, because I mean, I don't know. I, <laughs> you said wean. Wean, yeah. Uh-huh. Wean him off. Yeah, because didn't she get him from a clinic or something? Yeah, it was like a clinic. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. So, yeah I, that's what I think. But too. when she grabs the bag out of her cooch, <laughs> she they like zoom in. She sits it on the bench, and he picks it up, and there's a little wet spot. <laughs> Nuh-uh. I swear to God. Really? I didn't know I, that. I don't know. Watch it right now. I, I mean, swear to God. you've seen it twice, so you should know. Like, it I'm was, writing. I was like, oh my God. I'm like, there's fucking like a moist circle on the fucking bench where she just set there's that fucking bag. moist circle in his underwear. Yeah. Um, Wait, has or not? So, I don't remember what it hot, what it hot. <laughs> do you think, do you think she just went like <laughs> pantyless? Yeah. Uh, I mean, wouldn't that make it easier? No, yeah. I just, I mean... <laughs> I, mean, I don't you know. know. I've never pulled something out of my vagina. Yeah. Me neither. Um, here's my question. I can't remember. What did Nas do with the drugs? I think he just put, he was holding them in his hand. Oh, and then he sh- tucked them in his asshole. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. He shoved those yeah. motherfuckers when in his got, ass. I go, we, yeah. we were watching. I was like, wait a minute. Is he putting that in his asshole? And Taylor's like, yep, I believe he's putting that in his asshole. Yeah. Yeah. Mom's like, oh, did he just put that in his ass? Yep. That's what you do with drugs. I guess. Yep. Just, just a bunch of bodily one, fluids all over that. I bet you those smelled good when he took them out. Oh, God. Uh, Could you imagine that? Pussy no. and asshole? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> but, like, why didn't he, I mean, I guess <laughs> you, I guess either way they would have been in his ass if he just swallowed it. <laughs> but. Yeah, I mean, that's what the condom's for. To keep them together and then you don't have to get the shit inside. Yeah. Hopefully they but, tied that really well. Um. Okay. But, so, and then she just, like, dips. Like, she was, like. Officer, yeah, like, she went home and showered, probably. Okay, but okay, and this is okay, okay, okay. But tying into okay. this whole little love triangle or love, not triangle, but yeah, love triangle, <laughs> little, little, straight line, yeah, straight line love. Her and him. Okay. And so <laughs> when they when they kissed, the date was February fifteenth on the camera. So it was the day after Valentine's Day. So do you think that she was actually falling for him, or it was more of like? Oh, I don't have a boyfriend because we just found out she broke with her boyfriend. I, I, and it was like I, day after Valentine's Day and she was feeling lonely. I don't care. Hey, so you remember when, what I texted you earlier today? Oh, I said, I, I said, even though the show's over, what do you think Cass will theorize about now? <laughs> and apparently it's Valentine's Day. Yeah, I, I neither know or care. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> That's good. I think she shoved, he shoved the teddy bear up his ass and they just didn't show it. And he pulled it out and he was like, happy Valentine's Day. Maybe. He might it was, have. It was like all shitty and stuff. All right, grass. That's it. Fat Jesus. <laughs> Fat ninja Jesus. I gotta come up with like a. I wish I knew how to draw. <laughs> me too. I'd have you draw <laughs> me some pictures. <laughs> uh, I would charge you for the pictures. <laughs> fucking Jesus. Um. Okay. So the defense. She interviews Nas on the stand. I uh, to me, it didn't seem to help. No. He just was like, eh, you know, we did well, yeah, Basically, it all boiled down to, I don't know. I, I, I didn't do it. I couldn't do it. Um, I don't remember. And uh, I thought he was going to say yes. Like, when he had that I long too, pause. I did, too. I thought he was like, and I, I was going to well, lose when the my did. fucking shit. That's when the prosecutor Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. But I I thought the same thing. I was like, I was you like, dude, if you fucking say yes, 
Yeah. So then, so like, and it was pretty quick. So, but then, then your girl Hagamuffin interview or talks to him. Was it? She's. He was the only one she interviewed out of all the. Witnesses uh, of the d- defense called? Yeah. Yeah. Well, she's going to get her fucking two cents in for him. And she made a fool out of him. Basically. Pissed yeah. him off. Yeah, I thought he was going to lose it at that one point. And he's like, would you like it? She's like, excuse me? I, and then she, you know, and then she's like, hey, you decided to testify. Yeah. Now you have to answer the questions. So then he thinks about it and does. And at the end, he's like, I don't know. I thought he was going to say yes. That was in the tra- original trailer. Right? And I was going to oh, lose really? my yeah, mind. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I remember I told you I never saw the trailer, and you're like, how did you not see the trailer? Put a thousand well, times. I can tell you I've seen the Westworld trailer, so you can't tell me you have fun, Funny thing about that, didn't see the Westworld trailer this week. <laughs> well, yeah, because you're at, uh, what were you? Rays? Fucking Rays. Rays? Hey, you, you ordered pizza? a pizza? Yeah, I ordered a pizza at 5.30. They go, 20 minutes. I said, all right. So I go up there in 15 minutes. I go, hey, I ordered a large pizza. Oh, we don't have a large pizza. I'm like, what? <laughs> Dude, the show starts at 6. I go, he goes, oh, we can get one in like 10 minutes. And I'm like, it's 5.55. Can, can you deliver it? It's fucking <laughs> killing me. And he, I go, well, did I call? Because, you know, there's like a raise, like fucking, there's like three of them within like driving distance. And uh-huh. I'm like, uh, I'm like, maybe I called the wrong one. And he's like, what number did you call? I'm like, 602-548. No, that's us. And he's like, who answered the phone? Usually I answer the phone. I go, yeah, it sounded just like you. He's like. <laughs> <laughs> so then I waited 10 minutes for the fucking Yeah, Yep, it sounded just like you. It did, too. He's like, hold on, call again. You call. Oh, he's my like, Hello? God. So then Angela had to pause the show. Yeah, I know. She called me. She's like, I'm on the Xbox, but what button do I hit? I go, it's not on the Xbox. She's like, okay. So I go to TV, guy, and you're like, no, no. It's not on the Xbox. <laughs> oh, God. It's like 30 minutes. Like, I'm missing the show. It's on for me. God. That's fucking and hilarious. And then she's texting me, did you get a discount? No, they said I didn't order it. Why would they give me a discount if they didn't think I ordered it? I would have thrown a fit. Out of they the left. they would have thrown you out. Thing. They don't give a fuck. It's like soup Nazis. I know. <laughs> soup, soup Nazis. Nazis. Yeah. It's... At- but that on a shirt. Yeah. It's, it's from Seinfeld. I'd get sued. Oh. <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> Just change the spelling of Nazis. Yeah, do it like they did Tusk. Nazi. Nazi. For the Nazi party. He hasn't seen Tusk either. Oh, God. Let me guess. He hasn't seen Yoga Hosers either. Jesus Christ. What's wrong with you? I know. He told me you were going to have me watch it. And then he's like, yeah, it's about a guy who turned someone into a walrus. Yeah. I'm like, mm, all right. And the I would goes, probably have a reaction to that. At the end, he goes, cuckoo, could you? Oh, they should have done that. They, they remember, missed out. Remember we said that, in, or I said that in the movie, it doesn't say it, like I was going to be pissed, and that no point did they say it. Yeah. I was so mad. All right. All right, anyway, so, yeah, she, okay, so she, right off the bat, she says he's a liar, because, like, he's like, no, I I'm not a liar. And she's, oh, they ask him something that he's going to lie about. Uh, so, like, like you, you stole your dad's car, would you consider that a lie, a type of lie? And he's like, yeah, you, you sold to, you lied to the doctor to get a prescription to sell drugs at school. Would you call that a lie? Well, yeah. And and then she really uh, made him look bad. Yeah, and got him all the way up to the end. And then that's when you get the I don't know shit. Yeah. So then, um, the defense rests after that in tears. That looked good too when her she starts crying. Oh, um, and I was like, what the fuck are you doing? Yeah, why did she? Because she made a fucking mockery out of it, and she—I uh, I, assume because she felt like a fool. Uh, I guess. And I think, I was I think like, that she was just like, "Oh, he's fucked." She doing? He's fucked. I fucked him. Stone wasn't there for one of the. Yeah, but he was there for that one. Because he had a look on his eye. No, oh, but it was one of the days. It was with the Undertaker. Okay. Remember we went? We went uh, over that. Yeah, yeah. Because he was doing the stepdad. Yeah. yeah. We're not doing. Bro, <laughs> he's what? Doing a different show than me. He was getting Bastard. subpoenaed. You know what I mean? No, because when she. Interviewed Nas, she sat down with like a like a shit eating grin, grin kind of, and Stone looked at her like, "You have no mm-hmm. clue. Like you're you're about to see what's really going to happen." At least that's how I took it. Yeah. Um. Wow. So um, I'm losing my mind here a little bit. <laughs> All right. Did you let's find place? it? Let's find it real quick. I know. I told. Well, so then, so. Afterwards, it's so basically they they just kind of show where everyone goes, right? I didn't see what you did. <laughs> um, so Stone goes home, cleans up, throws away his cat shit, gets brings the cat back. Yeah, and the guy's like, "Oh no!" Yeah, that guy was upset. Wasn't yeah. He? Um. So then, you know, the problem is, is when you write notes, you should be able to read them. Yeah, usually. Mm-hmm. Um. 
But that usually helps. But I did have to watch the fucking thing twice. Maybe, maybe so. you, that's when you should listen to me and type your notes. So he throws away all the cat writer. shit. You have an iPad and, he's, and tick, a computer. He's cleaning the cat room, vacuuming, and then don't they cut to prison? And uh, Nas yeah. is getting a tattoo. Yeah, Nas is getting yeah. his neck of a crown. Neck. Like this ties back into my theory. Oh my god! But, oh my lord! The cat and Nas are parallel. They're fucking the same goddamn story. How's how, what does the cat have to do with the crown? The cat got a tattoo on his no, neck. No, the cat. See? Oh, I missed that. The cat goes back to the pound. Okay, mm-hmm. like just giving up on him. Like oh no, yeah, burnt. I'm with you. And yeah. then Nods is getting that because he's like, "Yep, I'm fucked. Like I'm gonna fucking be in prison for fucking the rest of my life. So might as well get a fucking neck tattoo." I g- okay. I, I, I'll I see give you that. That's at first, I, I was like, "What the fuck is he gonna say here?" But no, I get <laughs> no, like, that, that, That's why I was saying. Like, kinda, kinda, I feel yeah. like that's kind of how the whole show was. Like, and I, I feel, feel like, like he explained it way better there, there than last time. Yeah. Because last yeah, time way I was like, better. "Oh my god, you sound like a lunatic." But now I get it. And, and I don't know if it was. I mean, like theory. I thought you were gonna go like off the deep end. But yeah, that was. I think it was pretty. And I think that's why the cat was in it the whole fucking show. Because it was like symbolism or whatever, like you know, like I don't know the word for it. That's the, I guess that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> well, no, I, I think you're right in a way, but I think for it was for Stone, like it was his way. He doesn't want to. He doesn't want to give up on the cat because if he gives up on the cat, he's given up on Nas. And Nas right. too. So yeah, I, I, yeah, but they play, you know, like I said, and they both fucked him over. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I mean, literally. So. Um, and then Box is like sleeping at the precinct, like yeah. in a bunk bed. Well, yeah, you're like, I, I was like, where the fuck? I'm like, what is he? I'm like, where's he at? That's what Angela said. And I'm like, is he in a bunk bed? Because I saw like the and then, springs. And there's know? like lockers and shit behind like, him. Where the fuck She's is he like, at? Is he, is he at work? And I'm like, yep. Well, I don't even remember that. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, he like woke huh. up. Yeah. yeah. And he's like, he just hops out of beds and beds. He <laughs> hops <laughs> he out of bed. Beds. Yeah. And see, and then right after that, he's like. He's like back at the desk. Yeah, and he's figuring out where that Ray guy, the accountant, is the financier guy. Oh, and he's circling Based, like phone numbers because he's the pinging from his phone. Right. Yeah. So the key is though. So he knows the guy is in the area, like is by her house or whatever. He did all this shit illegally. Yeah. None of it could go to court. Oh, and I feel like yeah. Yeah. So, if I mean, there is a season two, yeah, they they haven't proved shit. Like, right. like they might know he did it, and I think he did it. Like, they uh, gotta figure out. Like, I heard is. like on that, they were talking a lot about this on Dan Patrick this morning. Oh, nice. Um, that's what's they, so cool. They were like, like, they were like, oh, there's like four suspects now. No, there's not. Yeah, there's there's one suspect. There's one, but it, it did bother me how they ended it with that though. Oh, let's go. Let, let's save that for the end. Yeah, yeah. but yeah, yeah, I got you. Yeah. Um. So, and then next it shows Box. He's like golfing, and he's at a casino. And and it, what, what the fuck was he wearing when he was golfing? That's what golfers wear. Uh, Do you see the hat the other dude oh, had on? Yeah, that red, like faded red. <laughs> that was, that's three hundred foot that, cause long when he brim. Away, and he's like, oh, he forgot his hat. He goes, that hat does not go with that outfit. <laughs> I was like, oh, that's pretty funny. Yeah, that is because I didn't even like think twice. It about was it. bad. Like so so. Ugh. So, and I guess, like, way back... Well, and at first, when... Because they show Box at the casino. And I'm like, why are they fucking showing this? Like, why... Well, the we casino c- was actually after the golf. Well, yeah, that's what I meant. Like, he go... You know, and I'm like, why do we care if he goes to the casino? And then I was like... Oh. And then we see him, and I'm like, oh, oh. so it was him. <laughs> yeah. Oh! Well, he's he was watching him gamble. Yeah, but the first scene that you there the camera's like yeah, back so, here, and you just see him, you just see him yeah. pushing buttons on the and pulling the. Oh, lever. so you had that thought like the. First I'm like, section. why the fuck like, do we <laughs> care why Box is at the casino? Yeah, I was like, was oh, that's, like that's so, and then, that's so you jump and then the they gun. change the camera well, no, I angle. It, I thought it was him trying because like, it shows him golfing and then it shows him there. So I thought it was just showing him that he is using some of his retirement to like relax because he's golfing and then there and then they show him uh, looking at the guy and I was like, oh no. Well, see, wasn't he that. trailing the guy golfing or did I make that up? Like he was waiting for someone for his next thing. Maybe that was him I golfing. Think that was him. I don't know. Yeah, I, I didn't. I didn't, didn't put get that. that together. I, maybe maybe it wasn't, and I just assumed it was. But now that you say it, because they zoom in a little bit, I mean, you can't really tell it's him. I mean, I, I couldn't. Because I don't think but he. Now wanted that you any, say that, that does make sense. Because like, I don't think he wanted. Because he looked frumpy as fuck at the goddamn. Him when he was golfing, yeah, totally. And he was like, had like khakis and a plaid shirt and that blue hideous jacket that looked like it was from the forties. I like that he's like, he's like, hey, what do you do? I'm a golfer. 
Yeah. He's like like a pro. Like he got his attention. Like a professional golfer? He's like, no, I'm retired. Like a retired golfer. So basically he confronts him, tells him he knows he did it. Um, So he was the cop on when scene like, when he shot. He got shot two inches from his balls at, by uh, a pimp. Where was he at? He said it was. Uh, he said he said it was in the two one. I don't know where the fuck that is. Two one or the one two. Um, I was just trying to rap over there. No, the, remember at the the very first uh, when Nas's parents go to see him, they go to the wrong precinct. He's like, "Oh, oh. you're in the two one. You got to go to the one two or that's, whatever." Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's all I was referring I, to. I, I, don't, I wasn't trying I don't to think, rap. I don't, I don't think it was those numbers, but yeah, I got you. It was the two one and the one two. I thought maybe. No, I think he's right. Yeah. Um, maybe. No, but I'm not giving it to him. I like. I kind of I liked how he's drinking drinking Johnny Walker Red Label, and he's like, you know how us retired boys do, or something like. It's got to be top shelf, like. Well, no, he said he took a step down. Oh, did he? Yeah, because he was drinking something else. And now uh, he has to, which Johnny Walker Red is not cheap. No, it's like what forty forty bucks a bottle. Yeah, uh, well, but like a big ass bottle. It's probably twenty five, uh, seven fifty maybe. That's not too bad, I guess. Maybe thirty, depending on where you go. But I mean, that's more than what I would want to spend on a fucking not, bottle of whiskey. <laughs> yeah, no one's drinking scotch. Ugh. Like especially scotch. Like that's not a popular drink. Now you got some single malts and shit, but you, what do you think about? Yeah, scotch? McClellan's right, or something like that. I mean, thought about it. He's has drinks House of Stewart. <laughs> it comes in a plastic bottle. I know. One seven five. Gross. <laughs> it's uh, like fucking uh, pop off vodka. Ugh. Yeah, pretty much. Um. So yeah, so basically this guy's guilty, um, and he even like what 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 purpose did it was there a purpose why he left his hat like did because he was I think he was, he was like pissed off and scared and like did yeah, that he help box at all together. though you know what I mean like no 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 it didn't help box is fucking with him yeah, and he was fucked with like he was he, like I, it I, fucked I, with his head like, yeah and he was just like I gotta get out of here yeah yeah because 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 the best part of the whole scene is box makes him stay. Talk shit to him. Tells him that he knows he did it. Tells him he knows where he was because of his phone. Right. He said, like, talk to my wife. He goes, well, you know, and then he says, like, all this other shit. And so finally he, like, turns around and starts drinking. He goes, what are you still doing here? You think I'm going to cuff you now? And he goes, I told you I'm retired. Fuck off. Yeah. <laughs> so then he's like, oh, uh. And then he leaves without his hat. So, yeah. I, 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 I did really him. like that part. I thought it was pretty cool. Yeah, I did, too. Just because, like, he was, like, showing that he, he likes it. It's the cops, the detectives like to show that they're smart. It seems yeah. like, you know. But he did. It was. I mean, yeah. He's the only one who gave a fuck, really. At the, well, on that side. Yeah. Um. So then, um. <laughs> Box meets with Hagamuffin, and and she doesn't. And really, tells him she's like, "Oh, we have more on." She's like, "We guy. have murder on the kid," and I was like. This fucking cunt. Did you say murder on the kid? That's what she said. More on the kid. Yeah, oh. more on the kid. Yeah, more on the kid. I was like, right, this I was like, fucking cunt. Yeah, like, I was like, are you really going to do that? Because, see, and at this point, I thought, we're not going to know who the killer is. And I like, I thought they were just going to, you know what I mean? Like, like what I, did he do? Well, but like. But, but I didn't think they were going to give us anything else, I uh, guess. Like, I, because like I told you, I was so ready to not like find out anything mm -hmm. i was a little well, disappointed that we found out <laughs> i well, know that sounds I, retarded i can't say this because i feel like if they do a season two i got a feeling that he won't be the killer or something or something's gonna come up because for example you know how there is the grace point broadchurch yeah there's a season two of uh broadchurch and mm -hmm. then you know how at the end it was the dad and all that shit yeah it turns out that it was wasn't him Oh, they yeah. made up shit for season two, and now they're doing a season three. That's about like the same case, I think. See, that would be annoying. So that's what I think they'll do if they make it up so that in season. So they oh, we tricked you in season one. Then I'm like, uh, yeah. I, I don't like that. I mean, but, I mean, I'm not, glad, not like I have a I'm glad I'll mom, still watch mom it. accidentally told me the ending of Bradchurch because I was like, oh, I wouldn't have liked that. I wouldn't have wanted to watch that. Yeah, that would have sucked. Um, so like, you know, they didn't plan that from the beginning. Especially doing no, right. doing yeah. that in two different shows, <laughs> like come on. Well, I mean, I guess in in, in Hagamuffin's defense, she's looking to convict. Like what? What could she have done? 
Like, could she have went to the judge and been like, "Hey, we have the wrong guy"? Oh, well, that's true. Because you said, like, you know what I mean. Like, everything was like they didn't, they couldn't have used all the information. I, I don't court. know how that would work. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I, I and mean, and like you I said, mean, she could just drop the case. Oh, well, I guess she did that. Well, I mean, so yeah, yeah, she could. But I mean, could she have like if if Box came to her like he did and said, "Here's look at all this. Like, I have all this. Like, this is it's not the Nas didn't do it." And she's like, "Oh, you know what? You're right, detective." Would she just drop the case? Like, could and she just, just go to the judge and be like, "Hey, um." I want to drop charges. I think so. Okay. And, I, and then, I, like I said, I don't know. And then so I don't think that, I don't think that would ever happen. Right. But I think. But, that, but I mean, it just be the procedure to do if I, they were going to. I mean, I'm guessing. It pissed me off when she was like, "We have more on the kid." Or yeah, me too. I was like, you "Especially kid. if you thought she said murder." <laughs> I did. I thought she said we have. I thought she. I thought she said we have murder on the kid. <laughs> and and then, like I'm like, like, oh what the my god! And then season two is when he breaks out of prison. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's when I love the show. Those two guys wow. help them. They, yeah. You know, God, I don't even know their names. Uh, I, I, I did, but then you made me forget it. Oh, good. So there's a new guy in jail. New kid in town. Fucking uh, Nas was buff as fuck in this scene. Oh, yeah, he's Nas was jerking off. Uh, yeah. Were you? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> he put his balls into his little wet spot. Ah. Uh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, um. No, but like <laughs> he looked like ripped out of his mind, like. He looked big. I was like, "Holy Jesus!" Like, no, he did look bigger. I think it was just. I remember, like, like, like a couple tight episodes white ago, shirt he was wearing. A couple episodes ago, I said something about him looking bigger, and Taylor's like, "I don't think he looks bigger." I, I think I called him buff, and she's like, mm-hmm. "I don't think he's buff." Yeah, t- Taylor's mom didn't agree that he looked buff, and I'm like, "Well, really? Yeah." What? Which I, I mean, he d- he did have a lot of shirts. He probably was buff in the beginning because he probably had like stuff covering. So. Yeah, he probably had stuff covering him. But like, and, and now they're just showing it. Do that sweater vest on. But anyway, he walks up to the dude, and he's just like doing like he's been doing it for fucking. 20 years yeah that's, I mean I thought it was like I'm like wow like he's you know, like fucking if, smooth yeah, he mean, knows the game in the prison that. now I mean, if, I was that, if I was that guy I would and then he goes back to Freddie and says he's married he can swallow his own wife's fucking and then Freddie's like look at him catching yeah. on yeah well, that, you know, yeah that was the funniest part is when the guy got when Nas got up mm-hmm. he like turned and the guy like flinched <laughs> and I'm like are you afraid of Nas like yeah well, I mean, he was a little intimidating in there no he was totally he's like wow like uh what happened to your face? And he's like, who did it? And he's like, I don't know. He's like, it's a good answer. Yeah. yeah. Well, then he says something, and the guy's like, yeah, that's exactly what happened. So then, what's your, what's your uh, guard boy's name, Tito? Yes. Um, he calls Freddy over, shows him a little DVD. Yeah. It was uh, Debbie Does Dallas. Oh, really? Mm. I missed that part. Um, no, they don't show what's on the screen. Freddy takes the DVD. Next scene, Stone has it at his uh, apartment floor. Um, yeah, see, so that happened. And I was like, oh, that's the DVD that Freddy had, right? And Tilly goes, no, it must be a different one. <laughs> and I was like, uh-huh. why would it be a different one? And she was like, I don't know. How did he get that there? I go, he fucking get McDonald's all the time. How's he not going to get yeah. it? Like, and he she bangs like, the like, almost security talk, guard. She almost talked me out of thinking. And I was like, no, it's got to be the same <laughs> thing. Wow. Um, when, they, awesome. when they showed that, I thought it was either the kissing scene or... They were showing Nas getting drugs. I thought it was from her. The drugs. I thought, I thought for sure it was gonna be the drugs. And I didn't like even he was gonna get kissing. pissed because like he was holding out, you know. I thought for sure it was the drugs. And I'm I didn't like, think it was oh ever. fuck, he's not gonna have protection from Freddie anymore. Like this might take a fucking wild turn. <laughs> um, uh, yeah. So Freddie takes it. I assume gives it to someone to give. It. Stone gets it. I mean, he, yeah. Somehow. Just Taylor's crazy. Just yeah. think of you can, how you can hashtag Taylor crazy. No, it's okay. Um. So, Nas or Nas, uh, Freddie did it intentionally. You think, right? Like to help, like get to help the Nas. Yeah, yeah. You think it was? Un- oh, no, 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 no. I don't think it was unintentional. Oh, okay. I think it he was because because oh. see, yeah, cause, cause he Stone thinks- thought, oh, we'll get a mistrial. Yeah, like so he's it- like great. Like that's why he took and, it well, to the judge. If, if you remember. All throughout the episodes, Freddie's known the game. Right. Of yeah. The and he's like always he one step it. ahead. Because he's like, oh, with no, the white she's, t-shirt. She's, yeah, she's going to get you the wrong yeah. shirt and all that bullshit. Yeah. The orange fucking jumpsuit. Which is weird. Like, how the fuck does he know all this? He's been around. He's gone but how, through. Because I mean, you know he was only like, little in the past life. Yeah. How does stupid. he... How does... I mean, I guess... I don't Omar's know. coming, yeah. What, Tito just watches all of Nas's visits with his uh, lawyers or what? Like, well, you know what I mean? Like, how do you come across that? Like... Oh, well, that's, that's that I, don't I don't think yeah. they watch footage unless there's something that happens. I could be wrong, but I, maybe he maybe. Well, I mean, because I'm I'm sure him and 
Yeah, Freddie talk a lot, so maybe he. Yeah, maybe he that. told him, and then he went back. Oh, Yo, go ch- uh, let's go check out. the video. I made out with. Yeah. I made out with the lawyer. She, she, well, he has told her that she believes me, so maybe that's true. Maybe mm-hmm. he told her some other stuff, like she stuck stuff in her coochie hoochie. And then I put it in my ass. So then they just start watching everything, and they're like, "This motherfucker's making out with her." Yeah. You know who should be in trouble is that guard that's fucking sitting yeah, across sitting in the from chair, him. Right he's there. turned around yeah, every fucking time like Barney Fife. And she's like scared of death. And, and like, he's like, he God, never turns like, around yeah. in any scene. I don't think. I think he has a physical impediment <laughs> that makes <laughs> him not be <laughs> turn. He physically cannot <laughs> yeah. turn around. So Stone gets uh, the thing, watches it, sees the kiss as Sean is like practicing. And I, like, I, you know how he had like his little external thing to put the dick. Like when I when it popped out, I thought it was like gonna disintegrate or something. Like, <laughs> oh my god! Like I thought it was gonna be like one of those like self destructing DVDs. You well, know, because like you know they, one of those you get. They pan right. off to the side I got a and, of those. and actually show the thing. Like, I don't, it was just good good camera work. I you guess. Thought it was gonna turn into like Star Wars part. or something. <laughs> <laughs> this message will self destruct in three minutes. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah. The things that go through your little mind. I want to write a TV show. Uh, I will not watch it. <laughs> yes, you will. It's going to be great. <laughs> he, if he writes a show, we can put it on Blake or something. Fucking Jesus. be a badass. Um, so as she's practicing her speech, Stone goes to talk to Nas and says, hey, we got a mistrial here. And he doesn't want to do it at first, and he has to kind of talk Nas into it. Yeah. But he eventually says yes. Because Stone is looking out for Nas. Right. Nas is worried about her. But it's a that. weird little yeah. circle tangle. Yeah. Oh, but a tangle web we we no, we 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 what we weave. Um. So now we're in the judge's chambers, and he's watching the video. So instead of a mistrial, he says, "No, nope. Stone, you're gonna you're gonna do the closing you're arguments. In, you're in the first yep. seat." And he's like, "So then, someone's like, I can't do that. Or, you know, he freaks out." Dude, he lost Prosecution shit. doesn't. Yeah, he do goes fucking crazy. <laughs> I got my phone was just sitting in the corner. She, like, she, she's like, whatever. This, this is, is great. Like, this, this is, is perfect for me. I've got this in the bag. Well, yeah. You already fucking called him up. Yeah. To fucking, I'm, yeah, there's no way I can lose this. Mm-hmm. Um, well, and Stone threatens the judge a little bit. And the judge is like, um, what'd you say? Yeah. And then he's like, oh, fuck, I can't threaten the judge. So then yeah. he backs off. Um, I'll take this to the. I'll peel it, as he, he said. He goes, that's that's not against the law. You, you go ahead. Yeah. And, but what the judge claimed is, is I think the judge kind of claimed that they did it on purpose. Oh, Cause really? He's like, well, because he says, um, alleged, uh, allegedly tried to make a mistrial or something. He was like, he insinuated that it could have been done on purpose to get a mistrial. Oh. Hmm. Which, I mean, that's how I took it. I didn't catch that, but... And I was like, I oh, that's why... So he's just not giving in. Like, okay, I see. You what if this. that was Chandra's plan the whole time? It wasn't. She I was, know, but yeah, I mean... She wanted, like, she you know but I mean? no, that's what the Nas judge dick. was saying. Yeah. <laughs> you say a little Nas dick? Yeah, she wanted a little Nas dick. Wow. Which we never saw that she got that. Season two. She didn't get it. She, um, she might have after. You know, he's out. She's out. But... And the judge is in True Detective and... Oh, wow. So is there Boardwalk, in Boardwalk Empire. Empire shows? He was cool in Boardwalk Empire. He played uh, George Remus, who's a uh, like a real life bootlegger from Cincinnati. Like oh. fucking. Is that Hell Remus's dad? No, but the guy was like a little crazy. Like he, uh, Remus is his, his last name, so he would be like, um, um, like I don't know. Like if he was doing a podcast, he goes, "Well, Remus thinks that uh, he would just always talk to himself in the third person, like in real I life." I can see us <laughs> doing that. <laughs> wow, yeah. Hess didn't like but this that's part the, of the show. That's the that's the character he played. So like, I, I just like the guy off the bat. He was a little nutty in Boardwalk Empire, but mm. not as nutty as he was in True Detective. But you know, was he was the killer in True Detective, right? <laughs> Yep. Wow. <laughs> is, that a, is that a spoiler? It is for Hats. Oh, I didn't know he didn't watch it. <laughs> We've only talked about this nine times, but yeah. okay. Well, I mean, on the bright side, I, well, didn't, so I didn't recognize As him. long as we did that, so that's the, that's the guy that, like, in episode four, who I like in Boardwalk Empire, like, they, See, pull, up, they pull up to the school, and I'm like, what the fuck's that guy doing on a lawnmower? That guy's, I know who that is. <laughs> and then, like, I'm like, oh, he's the fucking killer. And I, so I told all them, they're like, you're a fucking asshole. And I'm like, eh, well, yeah, it, I, and then, like six episodes later, he yeah. was the killer. When you texted me that, I I still didn't recognize him. 
after seeing Oh, it really? I, well, but you know, man, I, I loved Boardwalk Empire. I, yeah, watched it. I, I, I had, fucking watched it twice. I had no clue who Remember, because I watched it with Mima. Oh, uh, that that's true, yeah. So, all right, so... Um, so Stone goes to, um, like a little eatery. I don't know what the fuck it was. It was like a Chinese food or it was whatever. Was it Chinese food? Yeah, I don't remember. something I, like that. I don't remember what it was. He ordered some kind of chicken something. Um, Box is there, I and he tells so. Box his plan didn't work, and Box is like, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. He's like, about. Who, who is it? Who did it? And, and then he leaves, and then the first time I watched that, I was like, well, Box didn't give it to you. Fucking Freddy gave it to yeah, you, but not, you but He doesn't know that. <laughs> yeah. Right, but the second time I watched it, who did Freddie give it to? Freddie would have contacts with the cops. And then as soon as Bo- he says he starts asking, who, you found some now, and who did you give it to? And then Box leaves. I was like, wait a second. Did Box leave it on his doorstep? Because Box would know where Stone lived. Uh, so maybe Tilly was right, and Freddie didn't get it to him. Well, Freddie gave it to someone who got it to him. Freddie yeah. initiated the, I want to get this to Stone. Well, no, but I, I'm, but I'm I th- saying. Right. Yeah, no, yeah, that for sure. But did yeah. Box leave it at his doorstep? I don't know. M- I took maybe. it he didn't. What? I took it he didn't. Like, this, I, I didn't, the first time I watched it, and then the second time I was like, well, wait a second, did he leave it at his doorstep? He might have, because he, did, he didn't even question why. He, he, he goes, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. He goes, you know, who, who who really did it? And he just gets up and leaves, doesn't say a word, which is just like him. Right. Mm-hmm. But he also avoids, like, the confrontation with Stone all the time and gets pissy when Stone, the whole episode, or whole season, when Stone would be like, you know he didn't do it. He's been saying that since, like, the first episode. Yeah. Yeah. And you know? that time he just like, walks away? Yeah. It could have been. That, that's possible. So, and then the next scene, you got uh, your girl, Allison Crow talking to Chandra. She's being real, she's consoling her. Yeah. The, the yeah. You made a mistake. Yeah. I actually wrote down what she said. And then she said, chin up, finish the trial, and then clean out your fucking desk. Yeah. Which was actually, like, I hated that bitch, but that was hilarious. The, it's funny, because I just thought it was like, Wait a minute. When did she like lose her license? Like saying all this shit, and then the girl's like, "Then clean out your fucking desk." And she was like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> there you go. Well, there you go. All right. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I kind of. We all kind of. At least I assume. Oh yeah. We that she was, was gonna, gonna lose her job. Yeah. Which well, I yeah. Mean, I mean, when you get disbarred, you usually yeah <laughs> usually not much use around the office anymore. Um. So and it shows like real, real quick, which like, is shitty. I mean, one kiss for four seconds. She doesn't have a that's job. What she, that's what she got caught for. How about it, smuggling it, drugs into prison? Well, yeah, but yeah. I mean, which I mean, they have the tape for still. So yeah, who they knows? Maybe going, maybe going, season two, she goes to prison. Going maybe it she's be. the there killer, and then it'll turn into orange is the new black. Oh, she's the killer. Oh my god! And then I'll quit watching it. Yeah. Orange is the new black, or that she's a killer. Both. Oh, uh, Okay. Um, so it shows Stone practicing the closing arguments, like, kind of briefly, and then it goes to the prosecution actually doing her closing arguments. Um, and then uh, she basically was saying that his testimony is redacted, kind of like an FBI statement or something. When they yeah, it's all blacked out. out. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, that was like her big... I thought that was pretty clever. I mean, Yeah, that was a big thing. I mean, pretty obvious, too. Yeah. 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 I mean, like, you know, like, hey... But He's th- leaving out the part like where he said he killed her. Nailed yeah. it home, like, oh, okay, like. But then halfway through it, <laughs> the detective who arrested the guy gets up and walks out. Yep. Which threw her off. Big time, yeah. Yeah, she was like all Because then she walked over to the table and she was like just like frozen there for a minute. Yeah, she I thought like, Box walked out. Yeah. No? Yeah, that's why I said. Oh, okay. Yeah. Who? He's the detective that arrested him. Okay, I, I just, <laughs> I was... I'm like, wait, what? I'm like, I thought box, because I just thought you would say box walked out. Well, I, I did, except that I but wanted like that to point was, that out. was important. Yeah, because he he originally arrested the guy, and he's right. like, this is bullshit, and just gets up and walks out, and then she's like, oh fuck. So then, like, do you think that changed her the rest of her closing arguments at all? Yeah, yeah. she <laughs> like hesitated. Well, and that's what yeah. we're saying. Yeah, I think he has. <laughs> he's like fucking out of Maybe it. he did have an out of body <laughs> experience just now. <laughs> he's like. I thought Box got up and walked out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fading. And then, I'm fading. And then, uh, d- do you think that messed her up at all? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what we just said. Um. So yeah, she's she's all tripped up. Yeah. I mean, Haggy Muffin's not on point. She was good at first, and then she kind of trailed off. And then she's like, "Nothing else, Your Honor." Yeah. Um. So then it goes back to Stone. <laughs> what the wow. fuck is that? I had a yawn. Jesus. 
<laughs> Young <Yeah>, Jesus. <laughs> That's what you call Peyton, Young Jesus. Mm-hmm. Um, Skinny Jesus. So, <laughs> so back to Stone. He's doing the closing arguments again, except this oh time he gets a little more itchy and Dude, scratchy. Oh my God, yeah. Like he had like a full blown panic attack. Yeah, yeah, like, and it he came, and it came. shot his inhaler like ninety fucking times. I, I was a little bit worried with that and like the pills he was taking and drinking his shit that he was yeah, gonna overdose. Exactly. Like, they were, they that cross, I'm like, dude, he's end. gonna fucking like <laughs> you kill mean, himself. You mean eating his shit because he fucking ate it yeah. too? Yeah, Ugh. yeah. I was oh, I thought, like, it did taste good I, with water. How good do you think it tasted powdery? I really Ugh. thought he was gonna die right there. Um, it crossed my mind. I, I mean, was, just when he was like, or like he wasn't, gonna, was he like, wasn't gonna okay, be able to talk. He wasn't gonna be able to talk to the there. thing. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I actually thought he was gonna look worse when they actually show him. Yeah, me too. But he looked like, fucked up. Yeah. Well, I mean, he had his white gloves on. Yeah, looking like yeah. Mickey Mouse. Yeah. Like, hey, folks. Hello, <laughs> everybody. I'm Mickey Mouse. Um. Yeah, and. I mean, it's got to be stressful to fucking stand up in front of all those people and then he have someone's life on. Well, his and hand. yeah. He hadn't said. There's a guy. There's a guy at work. Second seat the whole fucking show. Yeah, didn't or the whole show. the whole uh, yeah, I know trial. There's a guy at work that gets real itchy and like has eczema, and I I never thought of, I never put the two and two together except that like when he's practicing, he's like. <laughs> Jesus Christ. He, he's he, practicing. He knocks mics uh, over. Bam. He's practicing. He's doing this shit, scratching. You know. And then, like, <laughs> it's like, you're like, oh, yeah. And I was like, oh, my God. It's, like, totally Todd at work. <laughs> so, like, we'll have, like, a meeting. And, like, in the middle of the meeting, I'll look over at him. And he'll be, like, not even paying attention. And he'll be sc- scratching like this. And his whole arm's fucking red. <laughs> you're like, dude, Todd, fuck. He's like, oh, sorry. And he, like, looks up. And I was just thinking, God, he's such a retard. But, like, hopefully he's not listening. Um, he might but, be. But now hey, I, Todd. <laughs> but now I actually feel... Like I'm like, oh, I kind of feel bad for Todd now. Wow. I'm going to buy him some penicillin. No, no, go to that Chinese guy. Get him some random shit. He get rid of cat. He could probably use uh, some Viagra, too. I Maybe. Don't, I don't know. I don't know. But anyways. What about Dylan Mauser? Oh, uh, we haven't mentioned his name. I don't know if you'd need Viagra. I don't know. Nah, he's got a living girlfriend. A oh. living girlfriend? <laughs> a living girlfriend? <laughs> well, I mean. Is she like. Is she uh, dead? Is she mail order? or? Kind of. Oh, okay. She's Russian. She's Russian to... Never mind. What? <laughs> um, Russian so, death. Yeah, so he does... Suck that ass. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, my God. So he does his closing arguments, and that's when has had his outer body experience. No, but like yeah. he killed it. Like, he killed it. Yeah, at, Dude, at mean, first he was nervous as fuck. He was, like, stumbling but over But once he words. started going, like, it was just like he got more powerful. And at the powerful. end, he was actually teared up. A little bit, yeah. They had the music going. It was like watching The Natural or something. Robert Redford. Hey, look at you. You got one right. Hey, look at that. Ding, 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 ding. Um, what did you think of the closing arguments? I thought he did a really good job. I, I, I was impressed. I with feel like bit. that was the saving grace right there. Like, he made up for he probably got like Chandra he, he pr- putting him on the stand. He probably, like, swayed a couple people. I, yeah. I think so, yeah, yeah. I would think so, too. Um, so then, don't they, like, go outside... Yeah, and the guy's like, yeah, nothing yet. Like, they, they're they waiting out there for I think they show Hag him off yeah. and smoking a cigarette. Yeah, they're all just waiting. Yeah. And the guy's like, like nothing, it, come back tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and so... And then She's like, outside smoking a cigarette. Chandra and Stoner in the hall. And then, and then the... Yeah, Nas goes back to jail. What do they call him? The... Hag muffins? No, the... Like, the cop that's in the room. They call bailiff? him... Uh, the, yeah, yeah, bailiff. bailiff. Oh, yeah, he the bailiff came out, and he's like, like nothing. yep, nothing today. See you tomorrow. So that, I'm like, that shit would it, fucking suck. It kind of no, it yeah, it shows them all, like, go home or whatever. Like, um, uh, Nas goes to jail. Um, and then uh, Stone goes to the pharmacy, gets his prescription. Tells, he tells him the bag is ready. Mm-hmm. He's like, I don't give a fuck. And there was fuck. no one sitting in the yeah. chair. He goes, I don't time. give a fuck anymore. He's like, yeah. oh, that's a good one. <laughs> and then he walks over and goes, like, you want a receipt? He just keeps on walking. Yeah, that pharmacist was a prick. Um, Chandra's cleaning out her desk. And then they show Stone at his fight club meeting. Which, originally, when they showed that, I thought we were going to get like a look in on the jury. I was hoping to God they weren't going to show the jury arguing over stuff because that gets so fucking boring. Well, because like they were, it was. And I was like, oh my God, the last half hour is going to be them arguing. Oh, you thought so? Yeah, and I was like, I was praying it wasn't going to be that. I didn't, I, I didn't care. I didn't want to see the jury. I didn't want to introduce. Well, at more first people. I thought I was like, oh wow, we're gonna, they're going to show the jury, and then I was like, oh, never mind. 
Yeah, no, it was just him at a skin meeting. Yeah. I called it his Fight Club meeting. Oh, that's why I was confused. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know what you were talking about. Wow. Okay. Well, there was a girl there, and then they started talking about testicular cancer. And Oh, I must have missed that part. Yeah. And then they beat up the Joker. And it was all a figment <laughs> of his imagination. Um, Maybe. So, um, yeah, I don't know. It, it kind of just shows everybody. Um, Freddy and Nas are doing drugs, and then he basically tells Nas that he thinks he's innocent. Yeah, that, this, yeah. this scene was, like, pretty... I don't want to say like it was pretty uh, intimate. Like, oh, you thought they were like, like going to make out or something? No, but apparently some like people on fucking? Reddit thought they were. Thought they were oh. going to fuck. I was like, w- I didn't get that vibe. But I was I, wondering a lot the whole of people. Freddie was going to fuck. A, lo- to be a lot of people. Really? I, I was kind of wondering about that. A lot of people thought that they were going to like make out. Oh, that never happened. Oh, on Reddit. Like, it didn't cross my mind. That'd be kind of cool. I don't funny. Know if I believe that. All of a sudden, starts making out with him and bending him over. See, I was so happy when Freddy fucked the guard in the beginning. And I'm like, oh, thank God. If I like this guy, I won't get made fun of because I like someone else who's gay. In yeah. Black. Yeah. Well, that's yeah. how I always like the gay black guys. I know. It's annoying. But anyways. <laughs> you ever watch True Blood? Yeah. But he got Lafayette. to be a, 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 I haven't finished, so did you, in case <laughs> I want to. So You're you? not going to finish. It's been over for like <laughs> 10 years. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and the Lafayette got to be annoying. Uh, a little bit, but I still liked him. Yeah, I like, I liked him. But there was a couple seasons there. And I was like, ugh. Yeah, but you tend Just to get from the end of seasons or shows. Yeah, so do the shows, apparently. Yeah, right. Weeds, I, Walking Dead. Fuck. True <laughs> Blizzle. Yeah, True Blizzle, as you called it. I, I still watched it. I liked it. I remember the second to last season. I'm not going to spoil anything, but me and you almost didn't watch the next season because of the way it ended. Yeah, that would have been And then the not. trailers made us be like, okay, no, we'll watch it. Yeah. Because we were like, what the fuck? But then it was all cool. Yeah, so the jury's deadlocked at 6 6. Uh, judge doesn't like that. We kind of discussed that already, but um, yeah. And he's like, "Nope, you go back and figure it out." And then the and guy's the, like, "No, like the form we're is like, the form fucking is like, not going to yeah, make any like, progress." Which I kind of wondered, like, well, because like everybody else in there has to kiss the judge at, judge's ass because it's their job. Yeah, he doesn't. Yeah, the jury, he doesn't give a fuck. He's like, no matter how many more times we go in there, the, it's not going to change. Yeah, which, I mean, he was just telling you the truth. It's not mm-hmm. like he was, like, standing well, yeah, up I, to I, him. I think he even said, I'm sorry. Like, yeah. No, I, I, I don't want to tell you that, but. But we're not going, we're not getting yeah, he's anywhere. Like, nothing is going to change. So he kicks them out, tells them to have a nice life, um, and then asks the prosecution if they want to get a new jury in there, like, Tuesday or some shit, Monday or something. Which, which I find retarded. Cause then they have I mean, to I, g- I get it, but... What do you say? Because then they have to redo everything. Yeah. Right, it's like starting a brand new trial. Yeah. Well, I mean, I I, I don't want to get into, like, the court systems, but, like, I mean, what else can you do? Yeah, but, like, he he's a free man, basically. Because he got, like, it was a reasonable doubt. Like, it was a hung jury. Yeah. So, and he's like, oh, well, uh... Uh, why don't we reconvene on uh, next Tuesday with a brand new jury? Yeah, but he, but like, but is he, that he was, standard? He was, he was like, asking if standard? she wanted to do that. Do you know what I mean? Like, I, is that standard? Yes. That's just stupid. Yeah. Okay. Okay, but that's I don't. But think he just went through one trial. That's I don't. And got off on a hung jury. He didn't, he, get, he off. didn't get off yet. He, they, you they, just they thought he got. They off. were asking for options, and then she said, "I don't want to press charges anymore." Whatever. Yeah, we're not going to. Yeah. She let him off. Yeah. But it, he had no point was he it, off. If they wanted to, they could have kept going until it was Yeah, the jury said, we can't do this. We can't figure this out. You need to get someone new, is what yeah. the jury was saying. That's why the judge wasn't going to have it. It doesn't look good in the judge's eyes if, if you're bringing no, in... Nobody he, else can Yeah, decide. it's like he can't control his court. Yeah. But, um... Did Hess just get, like, lost? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, yeah, I get, that's it. So, were you happy when, um... That happened and then they said he's off? Um, I was happy for Nas. I thought it was a st- kind of a stupid way to end the show. Not and not that it ended there, but like I I didn't really like that. I don't know. I didn't I didn't like that at all, either. Uh, I, I was like, re- well, like, because it like it okay. took them so long. They were leading to that point of like I mean, going like, in the court, and then they took there was a lot of time, a basically a longer episode to show all that shit, and then to be like, and eh, we can't decide, so he's free. Yeah, and, and but really what happened was is she took Box's word and let him go on because Box had information on the other guy, not because of the, the jury, but I know yeah. what you're saying. It was still a letdown because 
Um, it's just not what I, I wanted someone to say, not guilty, and then him to jump in his mom's arms and make out with her and all that stuff. I did like those. So, like, after that, he's off. They Everybody goes home and, you know, does oh, yeah, their yeah. shit. Yeah, wait. I got something to tell you for that. Oh, really? Yeah. So, um, I think I might have already told you, though. Maybe. I don't know. You tell me a lot of stuff. Um, you have anything to say about the ending? I, I'm fine <laughs> with the way it ended. Really? Are you were cool with the... Yeah, I am. I mean, I'm like I said, I wasn't really expecting to find too much out. I wasn't... I was just kind of preparing myself not to find out. So your too low, much. Your low expectations helped. Yeah, I think so. Definitely. I mean, like, that can, I, that I had, can help. I had low expectations uh, for a while, and I I was still mad at the ending. I wasn't mad, but I was a little disappointed. I, I was pretty disappointed in it. Um, but I mean, I still liked it in all in, in the whole. I still enjoyed it. I just didn't like that part. I enjoyed bits and pieces of it. Um. So yeah. So then it shows he gets out of jail. Well, he's, like, packing up his shit. Well, I, I guess first, like, so as soon as she said we're not going any further, Shauna just gets up and walks away, and then she's done, right? Like, that's it. You don't see yeah. her again. Yeah, you never, you never see her again. Yeah. yeah. I Which, mean, but I thought was dumb. Is so, like, she does all this shit for him. She gets fired because of that, and then never sees him again, as far as we see. Well, because he was part of the reason that she got fired. Well, we've been, why not just keep going on with it then? I don't know. That's, oh, that's I, her call. Yeah, but like I, th- I thought that was like... Because then to me, it's even... It's not more, like it's she even, made a good decision well, in the last like two episodes. Yeah, but so. it makes it even more pointless that she did that. that she doesn't even yeah, because he actually again. looks back like, well, where's she going? Yeah, and she's just like, oh, I'm out of here. Whatever. Yeah. I, I, that that was one of the other things that disappointed me. That, like, we don't even see her oh, see, I didn't, at the I, end or I, anything. I, when she walked away, I was like, eh, bitch. Oh, really? Yeah, well, because, I mean, I don't know. I mean, she she stopped listening to Stone. That was her downfall. Yeah, I get so. That. I, I and I liked Stone a lot. So like when she stopped listening to him, I, I was like, whatever. I mean, yeah. y- you don't really. I mean, like I said, I it. liked her character through the whole show, and then I just didn't really like how her character just ended. I mean, I didn't. I, didn't like I get. I get why it. they did it. I mean, I you know she did what she did, and that's kind of what had to happen. But it right. was like, um. Uh, see, I was perfectly fine with it. I saw a lot of people are mad. Um, I can't think of her name. You know the girl in Zack and Mary make a porno? I can't think of her name. Elizabeth Banks? Yeah. She's She was tweeting about it, and a couple other people were, about how, like, sh- they loved, they liked the show up until the last episode because of what they did with her, and how they ended her character, and, like, and then, you know, people are like, oh, females in movies and shows and stuff like that. Oh, for fuck's sake. So, like, a lot of people, a lot of big, big celebrities are mad about that. I, just, I saw that earlier today. Oh. Yeah, I think they should worry about other, other shit. But, yeah, I mean, whatever, I guess. Mm-hmm. Um... So, and then um, Hagamuffin gets up and leaves, and I totally thought of Hess. Really? So she wow. gets up. They just show her, like, from the ass, oh, and she, ass down. Mm-hmm, she had different shoes on and all that. Yeah, she had, like, sensible shoes on. I'm like, you think yeah. Hess noticed that? And he's like, oh, she's totally wearing sensible shoes because her feet, like, bother her or something. You didn't think any of that? No. I just figured she had uncomfortable shoes because oh, okay. she was in shoes all day. I, I th- I'm in shoes like, all she... Day. Well, so am I, but... <laughs> No, I don't know. I, that's seriously. I was like, "Oh, look at her shoes." Oh, I bet Hess has something to say about her shoes. But now you let me down. He's like, "I got a figurine." Sorry, <laughs> those aren't really her shoes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Maybe she had a op- stone slip those on her, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and he put something in the shoe to make her. <laughs> yeah, could you imagine? Oh my god. Um. So then, um, <laughs> I, I'm totally let down that she had nothing to say about her shoes. Um. Oh. So. Nas, <laughs> Nas packs up to leave. Um, Freddy's nowhere to be seen. Right. And then as he's, like, just about getting out, it shows him, like, hitting the heavy bag. Never fucking turns around. Ne- yeah. And Nas wanted to say goodbye You know, to I him. partly thought that Nas, when he saw him, he was just going to run over and give him a hug. I don't know why that just popped in my head. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. I was like, oh, he's going to run over there and be like, see you later. Like, bye, Freddy. I love you. <laughs> but that didn't happen. Do you think Nas ever called him Rico? No, I don't think he uh, did that. Okay. Um, so then as he's getting his shit, he gives him the Call of the Wild book, which yeah. is the oh, title of the episode. Title of the show, yeah. Um, or the episode, title of the episode. Yeah, didn't he um, say he already read it, too? Yeah, yeah so uh, now he gets to read it again. Oh, like, no, thanks, I already read this. I, got, I think that was just like a memento, yeah. remember me. Yeah, I yeah. kind of, yeah, I But, I, I was and then, I, like, as, as they're taking Nas out of Riker's... <laughs> I kept thinking like someone was gonna attack him from behind. 
I was wondering about that too. Actually, I, I, like the entire time. Well, because it took like, him like fifteen oh, fucking minutes. They're walking to get through there. the halls it or whatever. Cr- it crossed I'm like, my dude, mind. Dude, someone's gonna fucking like kill him. The, the only thing is, or is, like you know what I mean. The like, only thing is, is all those places are in are high security. No, for I one. know. And then for two, a lot, ten times, you like yeah. Most of the guys are new and are yeah. scared shitless of him. A, a lot of times in shows though, and so that like someone's leaving a prison juice of that, someone something gets loose yeah. and something well, happens. It, and that the, happens. The, or even like a prison the guard music would do they something. Play, you know, it's like yeah. it's just so ominous. It's like. Well, I only thought oh, it too because fuck, it like, took, I don't even remember the music. It took him forever to get out of there too. I, well, yeah, and then it sure. took well, like two showing, minutes for the showing fucking like you're not going anywhere. It took two minutes for the fucking when that big open, ass door to open. open. I'm like, oh my god! <laughs> like when they open that, uh, mom goes, "What is that?" <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, "It's the fucking door." Have you seen anybody mm. in any movie and leave and prison? I'm, I'm like, they're on the Death Star. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> And then, so, his dad's there to pick him up. Who did you think was going to be there? I thought uh, Chandra was going to be there to pick him up. Like, really? God. I did. I thought she was going to pick thought, him up. They were going to make th- out and drive into the yeah, sunset? Yeah, he thought it was the notebook. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> well, fuck. They went romantic. Why not finish it? I mean, she did stick stuff in her vagina for him. That, wasn't that is romantic as fuck. Mm-hmm. Well, they kissed and made out. In she jail. went and got drugs for him. <laughs> he, put her, he put her vagina I mean, you know what I mean? Bubble. Like, yeah, there was screwed. clearly something there. You know that's love. Yeah, it's over when she walked out. That, yeah. That's why you were so upset because you're a romantic at heart. I yeah. get it now. Yeah. Now I understand it. <laughs> yeah. Eh. I do like it. Yeah. Yeah. So, and then Box is meeting with Hagamuffin in some like diner or some shit. He's got his NYU uh, security jacket right. on. Right. And uh, he's like, it's a job. Mm hmm. And then she's like, I got a job for you. Let's, Let's get go that. get that guy. Right. Which totally could be season two. Like, if you think of it just like. Yeah. Right. No, it probably will be if they do it. Yeah. I mean, that'd be cool. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I'd watch it. I don't know if I would. Um, I would watch it. I mean, what choice? To, I mean, what else were we going to watch the last eight weeks? I don't know. Big Brother. Could have. That <laughs> was more entertaining Ooh. than the last episode to me. Well, maybe if you don't know who's winning the competition before you start watching I, it. I knew it. I still like Big Brother better than it. <sighs> um, so then they're eating dinner. Nas is eating like it's prison. He's yeah. like taking his shit and fucking dipping yeah. it in his mattress. When Brother, it, it, brother's what, what, checking out his tattoos. Was it his dad that was like, you know, just because like, you're home, you can go out and do something if you want to. Was that his dad that said that? Yeah. yeah. His yeah. dad was cool, mm-hmm. which is funny. I like, no, totally is, never expected his dad to be cool. Yeah. <laughs> so this is where we get to the mom, right? Yeah. So then the mom's like looking at him, kind of like wondering what the fuck. Like she's like, oh, my little boy. And then she looks away like, oh, my little boy. Like, yeah, I don't know. She's yeah, a when, fucking bitch. When yeah. she was doing that, I was like, oh, really? You know, like, Two episodes ago, you're like, oh, did I give birth to a monster? Right. So... And then they go sit down in bed and have a little talky too. Mm-hmm. And I, when they sat down there, I go, God, I hate the mom. She's such a bitch. Mm-hmm. And uh, our, your mom is like, why? Of and course. I, and I'm like, because she fucking thinks that he killed the girl. Yeah. yeah. And she's like, no, she didn't. And I'm like, yeah, she did. She fucking said it in the fucking bathroom. <laughs> she's like, no, she just got up because she didn't like all the bloody. And I'm like, no, she said I raised a monster and then fucking wouldn't let the other girl touch and then I kind of remember it halfway through when I'm, like, going over it with her. Mm-hmm. That she's, like, not doing the podcast, so she doesn't know that we had this big conversation about what a bitch the mom uh, is. And yeah. then I'm like, oh, never mind. And then he goes, yeah. like, he's like, whatever, mom, and walks out. I like that. Yeah, I did, too. He's like, I was like, I'm like, good. And, like, he knows that she didn't. I kind of thought, thought he did it. Like, the brother looking at the tech was giving him funny looks, too. And I was like, what? Well, fuck you. Like, I don't, I don't know why. It's like. Well, I think the brother was just thinking, like, oh, it, it, it did kind of change you a little bit, like. Because I'm assuming, from yeah. what I've seen, the old Nas went to got tattoos like that and like shaved <laughs> no. his head and shit like that. No, but yeah, like I don't know if the brother was thinking like I see. I I don't know. I was just thinking he was like, oh, you like. Yeah, it, maybe. It seem, like, maybe I was. I was thinking was like he was just like, oh, fuck. You probably did. I don't know. Like he just seemed like he was giving off a weird vibe. Whereas the dad was like, oh, do you want to go play with your friends? <laughs> I think the dad was gonna yeah. get money. Well, to go yeah, to he was cool. He was like, yeah, yeah you go do whatever you want. Um. So then he goes to like some market and meets Stone. When he was leaving, I was like, "Oh, take steal the dad's taxi." I was like, "Maybe just get back <laughs> wow. into it." And I was like, "And then go pick just up another girl back over and again. Get, kill her." But that didn't happen. And then it turns into Groundhog's Day, and then mm-hmm. Stanley Phil comes into it. There you go. Um, so yeah, they're so uh, he's getting all these looks and shit, and then his little buddy comes in. Yeah, like, he kind of punks him a little bit. Yeah, he like just looks at him and dude like, fucking runs out, and Stone's mm-hmm. like, "Oh, you did learn something." <laughs> it's like, yeah. wow. Um, and then. Nas 
score some coke or some fucking something. With whatever, heroin. Wh- whatever he's been doing. Whatever yeah, he's heroin. doing, yeah. And then goes and sits in their little spot where they were on the beach or on the river. And he started getting flashbacks to her, right? And he's like, he smokes it up. I didn't even, like, because before they don't pan out. And mm-hmm. he's, like, smoking. You know, I just thought he was, like, somewhere. Uh, and they pan out and they're going to say, I go, oh, he's in the same yeah, spot as the you girl. Know, you know what's funny? What I thought he was going to do, which I thought this was going to get, like, the ending that I wanted. I thought he was going to, like, go back and basically drive through the, or walk through the night, like, where they were. Like, go to uh, the river and then go back to her house. And I thought he was going to, like... I was like, "Oh, what if he goes back to the house How and we see, and we, and we, and we see like, <laughs> and we see like a vision of him killing her or like something, and we get to get to ah! see what, what happened?" But then he's just sitting there and fucking smoking. Yeah, he's just getting high because his because his life is fucked up now. Yeah, no he's one, a drug addict. Basically, now. he's yeah. a drug addict. No one trusts him, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. even though he wasn't found guilty of anything. Like, yeah, but they still. It's pretty that shitty. I mean, if you think about and it, and it's like, such a small community of like closeness, you know. Mm-hmm. He should just. I mean, not like he was better off in jail, but like he probably, it probably, he's probably thinking maybe sometimes that he is. Yeah, probably. Yeah. You I know? mean, at least like in there, and there he has power, and there he has friends, and there he has. Yeah, whereas like everyone, it seems like, like everyone that. except his dad was against him, and Stone. Yeah. yeah, that's true. I like too on the closing argument when Stone sat down, and they were playing the music. He like sat down, and they didn't, they weren't really playing. Um, like noise from from the show or whatever. Like mm-hmm. Nas said, "Thank you" to him. Like and oh, he, really? you you could like it, he like mouthed it. He's like, right. "Thank you." It was like almost in slow motion too. That looked like it was like from the heart. Like he was like he wasn't just saying thank you for the closing argument. Right. He was saying thank you for the whole fucking thing. for everything. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, but that's, that's it. Like a big no, deal. Well, you get, forgot about how Stone got the cat back. Oh yeah, and then they're showing the ASPCA fucking infomercial. Yeah, which I thought was dumb. Like, they they, what they the showed fuck that is this and like, like well like it, uh, well, like it makes you seem like he's like oh I'm gonna go get the cap. But then he already fucking had the cap back anyways. Yeah. And then he gets the call or whatever, and he's like yeah yeah well, don't the, talk to me. And anymore. like no, he's not. Um, well, he's back. He, he's back to he's, his normal. Well, but life, he's not except he's, for the cat. He's not anymore. No well, cat, he didn't free lock either. the cat in the lock. He didn't lock yeah. the cat in the room either. But well, he, he changed the way he, he's not free. Free till you or free till you're free or whatever. Like no fee until you're free. Because like you show him on the bus and he sees his little thingy or whatever. Oh yeah. yeah and then yeah, the yeah. guy calls him. He's like yeah, two hundred bucks cash, whatever. I'll be there in a little bit. Two fifty cash, yeah. no checks, no personal checks. Yeah. So like he like changed his ways a little bit. Yeah, I didn't even catch that. Now that you mention it, mm. but that, I thought that was like a little I, odd that he changed well, his he ways. Learned his, you know, learned. Well, yeah, he, he got thirty thousand from uh, Oh Chandra. Yeah, so that helps. Yeah, maybe that's maybe he bought some cat antibiotics to help <laughs> him through. Maybe yeah. it was weird yeah. though because like I, all that honest, time and then he just lets the cat run around the house. I didn't really care that he got the cat back. I gotta be honest. It didn't. I could give a fuck less if they cut that cat's head off and shoved a fucking stick of dynamite up its ass. Well, I wouldn't. Why would you shove a stick of dynamite up its ass and cut its head off? The fuck, I don't know. Like, I mean, if you're gonna shove the dynamite up, it's, fu- it's funny like that he says stuff like that, but then he's like, the cat and Nas are like parallels. <laughs> well, I, I don't like cats. Nope. Oh, I don't. So, but I'm just saying, like, well, dogs don't like it. you. Maybe you should go after yeah. cats. No, <laughs> nope. Uh, just this no. fucking so my sister fucker. my sister texted me and was like did you watch it and I'm like yeah she said I'm so glad he had the cat at the end people go for that shit yeah Taylor was having yeah. that too really I mean I was like oh he had the cat on it go- I think mom was like oh that's like but well, that- all right so you tricked us he didn't go back and get the cat like whatever <laughs> right. mm-hmm. I mean Ba-ba-ba-da-da. yeah we saw the stupid commercial yeah and the, yep. cat, the cat winked at him in the commercial did you guys catch that. I, I looked for it the second time because you guys said that. It was weird. We were just watching the cat. It. The, cat, the it, cat winks. It's like I twitched, but yeah. It winked. Otherwise known as winking. <laughs> Whatever. <Wow>. I, <laughs> the cat was like, hey, how are you doing? I just thought it was weird that, like, they put that in on purpose, probably, but, like, it was weird. Yeah. But so but, yeah. And I, you know, I expected him to be like, oh, shit, I'm going to go get the cat, but the cat's already there, so whatever. That's what I thought, too. That's why I thought putting that video and all that was kind of pointless. Well, but, it was to trick us. Well, yeah, but like there was a, it was a pointless trick, I think. Yeah. Because they could they could have just showed him getting the cat back or something or I don't know. They were pulling at people's heartstrings. Like yeah. I'm sure yeah. Melissa was having a fit. Probably, I guess. Yeah. The fucking get the fucking. And then you know what she compared it to? What? Which actually is a good comparison. Uh, um, unlike you with comparing to Nas, you remember when Tony Soprano had the ducks? Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> That's what she compared it to, which is kind of yeah, that is kind of good comparison. Kinda, yeah. He was. You, just, you didn't watch the Sopranos, or yeah? 
Watch the first season, so I know what you're talking oh, about. Oh, yeah. So I remember how weird he yeah. was with those ducks? I saw, like, the first three, and then I don't remember why we stopped. I don't know. We were probably watching 800 shows. Yeah. <laughs> we did, we did 800 shows. Um, but, but So what did you guys what did you guys overall think of the show? Oh, that was good. I enjoyed it. Like, I was happy with the way it ended. If it, if if it's done, done, I'm totally fine with it. Yeah, I almost hope they don't do a second season. Just because, I, like, I it's do hard. I do, too. I think it's hard to live up to. Um, do you guys want to know how the British one ended? Sure. Because we looked that up on YouTube. Oh. Oh. Who's we? Me and Taylor. We looked, oh, we looked. I thought you guys uh, did. Did you no, no, talk no. about it on your I'm a Goldfish podcast? I'm a, I'm um, a Goldfish. Actually, no, we didn't. I'm a, I'm a, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a Goldfish. If it would have ended this way, I would have been a little more. So not the, not Nas, but the character. I don't know if his name is the same or not. It's I, not. I don't think it's it is. a white guy in the yeah. BBC show. His name's Sands. But he get he gets off <laughs> because. But I think it's like almost the same type of thing where he gets. I don't. Did not the exact same way, but he gets his lawyer in trouble for doing something. Oh. And he admits to that, like they did it. And then he gets, like, they they see, you know how in, like, the UK they have cameras everywhere? Yeah. On one of the cameras, they see the girl getting chased that night by someone else, like, by the, whoever the killer is. It's just a random guy in the, in the, in the BBC Freddy, one. Freddy Krueger. So some, they see some random guy chasing her, and then she goes back and she runs into her house, gets killed by him, and then he gets framed. It's basically the same thing. Uh, like that. Yeah. But so then he's like, okay, well, since I'm free, like, trying to get, like, the lawyer back off, and they're like, no, just... Go live your life. Get out of here. But hmm. so it, it would have pissed me off as just some random guy on this one. Yeah, I mean that's something you can't see. Like if they don't show him like on a lawnmower in episode four, like <laughs> how are you supposed to know? You know what I mean? Yeah. Although uh, one thing Taylor brought I like up that, that I thought was like I agreed with her for this mm-hmm. is like she said it's almost unfair that they made it that guy because you can't even really follow the show. Like you don't even because they didn't introduce him to like episode five or something. So like anything up to there doesn't even really matter because. You know, you can follow like, oh, it's this and that and that and that because you don't even know who he is until then, until like halfway through the show, basically. Sorta. I mean, I get what she's saying, but he was in episode two, the money guy. Yeah, because he's arguing with the dad. Yeah, but you don't like we didn't know that who he was. No, we didn't know who he was, but he was there, and then he was in. I don't know which episode, but then remember, because remember. When Box was it? Bo- no, Stone goes to talk to him. Yeah, that, that's what I was talking about. That's, that's like episode like five, I think. Oh, maybe was it that late? Mm-hmm. I think so. Yeah, it was. It was late. Yeah, because um, like you, you see him briefly, like I didn't even recognize the guy. But then but when we, we saw him in that office, I recognized who he was. Oh yeah. So that's I just I thought that was like a little. But it's one of those things where like you knew in episode two you were going to find out who that guy was. Oh, I didn't know if we ever would. I mean, oh well, I figured we would. I mean, he yell- he had it on film and like I guess yeah, you know what I mean true. yeah. I mean, if you remember when I when I watched, I was like, oh, maybe this guy's it because he's trying to th- he's so, he's pushing the dad so much. Maybe it's him. Mm-hmm. And then I like talked myself out of it because it seemed too obvious. And, yeah, like, and then it ended up being him. Yeah, um, because he was pushing the stepdad. You know, which is weird. You think if you just kept, well, I guess none of that had to do with getting him caught. So I guess that didn't matter. Well, and Stone never went after him. He was talking to Stone. Stone went after the stepdad. Yeah. So like what he did worked. It threw Stone off. But like, yeah, but like, but Box never was thrown off and never talked to him about it. So. Yeah. Or I mean, I was just glad it wasn't the, the hearse it. driver. <laughs> <laughs> and it wasn't the guy staring at her. If it would have been Dwayne Reed, that would have been the dumbest thing ever because he uh, just staring at her at the fucking yeah, first episode. Yeah. That would have been so yeah. retarded. Or if it, if it was the first driver, I would have been okay with that. I, I just really wish we got to see what happened. Like you wanted image, I, I wa- images I wanted from to, that? I night? wanted to – no, I, I, well, yeah. I, I wanted to see a video of like him well, coming into the house and like he sees Nas leaving or something and goes upstairs. And, yeah. Like, the deer head I played no what role. Happened. Yeah, there was yeah, no ne- camera in nothing. The yeah. yeah, that's I thought about that too. I nothing totally like that. hadn't even thought of that. Until like you half the that. shit we Not said, a damn thing, d- didn't play into. I mean, they into it really. Well, we that said a lot. Shit. Head, yeah, like episode seven, one, five times. Time. Time. Yeah. yeah, well, and they showed it you so know? fucking much too. Oh yeah, totally. Anytime they were in that house, they showed the deer head. Yeah, yeah. but I mean the the show did get us thinking. I guess yeah. Yeah, I mean absolutely. Um, and I mean I don't know. I, I was. We all, you never really picked someone who you thought did it, did you? No, I just hoped it was Nas. I mean, I did, I really like your theory about the guy who it was. Like, when you said that, I was like, oh, that'd be cool. I, that, I kind of like that. But then it didn't play out how I, like, how mean you talked about it. it was better in our heads. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but other than that, I never really picked anybody. 
Yeah, I just like I I never had any proof. I, mean, there, I wanted there's, it to be the stepdad for just me, to have that true there, detective link. For me, there's never anybody that I was like a hundred percent on, or even like a little, like I thought, oh, it could be them. And then, it, like, it became evident. Like, I mean, because I, I said the stepdad from the f- first episode, and then it became evident that he's just too obvious. Yeah. You well, because at first then, it seemed like they weren't going to go uh, back to him, like, but then they started to go and they did a lot with him to where, like... And then you're like, oh, fuck, it's not going to be him. It's yeah. too early. It's like it's like catching the criminal in the fucking first 15 yeah. minutes in NCIS. Yeah. NCIS. You yes. know he didn't do they, it. They go to the crime scene 10 <laughs> minutes later, they get a guy. You're like, like, oh, he didn't do it. Yeah. And then they figure out who the real guy is. <laughs> yeah, but... But I don't know. I, I liked it. Um, like, it's not as good as True Detective. Oh yeah, I agree with that. True Detective season one is way better. Um, it's. I think Flash season one is way better too. <laughs> um, <laughs> all right. Throw that in there. I don't know, but it, but it was good. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed I enjoyed parts of it. I I, I thought it's I thought it was better than anything I've watched recently. That we kind of got into. It's better than. I don't think I can't think of anything. It's better than like some of the other shows that are on HBO right now. It's, I'll tell you this: it's better than Scream on MTV. I'll tell you that for sure. That's good. Well, that's another show with a killer that I've seen. Wow. That, that that's probably the worst show I've seen all year. Why aren't you watching MTV shows? <laughs> well, I watch I watch a lot of MTV shows. I like real watch oh, MTV shows. All right, I get that makes sense. I guess. But like, I watch Catfish. Yeah, Catfish is awesome. Well, that's not like a murder mystery show. Well, yeah. Neither is Scream. Yeah, Scream. Oh God, that show's fucking terrible. And I did watch American Horror Story, but I didn't like that show either. Yeah, see, I mean, I don't know. I, I, I was just... I'm I, just thinking of more shows to, like with a killer that you can compare it to. Well, and I was just kind of comparing it to like an hour-long drama on like either Showtime or HBO. Yeah. Those yeah. are the good ones. Um, so what was better, this show or the last season of Game of Thrones? <laughs> oh, Jesus <laughs> Christ, Game of Thrones kicks its ass. Uh, it's not even a comparison. Yeah, I was just saying that because I knew you'd be like, oh, Game of Thrones. Um... But I mean, but it was good. It's up there. It's certainly not. It, it was better than season two of True Detective, I think. So, right, do you guys think there will be a season two, or do you think this is just people talking because the show's I don't. over? I think it's just people talking. But I think it's people talking in TV with Nick and Josh. Josh. Come on, laugh and bed. Did you show him the picture that did? Oh, no, God. we'll show him after. Uh, if you, I'll just, I'm gonna say right here. If you go to therealplica.com and you go to the Plica Sports page, underneath Plica Sports, it says "Coming at you live from Jones' bedroom." <laughs> <laughs> wow! So that was pretty awesome. Yeah. All right. Like the homo. <laughs> is that so? Is that the end of talking to you, Nick and Josh? That's it. So, so ne- next week, are you guys gonna be doing the wire, or are you guys g- are you, you guys going on break until Westworld starts, or like what's gonna happen with this show? I do not know. Yeah, I don't think we know yet. You might. Oh, you don't want to. Like, we can always it? we can always do a couple wires before Westworld World starts. But, you, like, but so like so right now for the audience listening, there might not be a talking TV next week. Probably there not. Might yeah, might not be. Oh, okay. N- not next week. Sorry to disappoint you guys. <laughs> um, you and then Westworld doesn't start till October. October second, yeah, yeah. so it's a month away. Yeah, yeah, which is good. Yeah. You know. So maybe we'll have a month's little break. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. Who knows? But if people do want to hear you guys, they can go over to Plinko Sports and watch you guys do some sports shit. Yeah. Sports shit. With sports Nick and Josh. shit. That's another show. They do talking TV and sports shit with Nick and Josh. Oh no, I'm sorry. Sports shit with Nick. And Fat Ninja. I thought you were going to say Jesus. I almost did say Jesus. Yeah, I, I almost came out. Uh, all right, so check us out on all our little... little yeah, realplicka.com. This will be up. Like I said, you won't know that, but... Uh, yeah, it'll be, it'll be anyways, up on realplicka.com Go check it out. Yeah, go to just go check out realplicka.com. It's a pretty cool little website. Um, so, yeah. So, Facebook, Instagram, <laughs> Spreaker, you know, iTunes. For a second. Yeah. My mind has really slowed down. Yeah. Um, iTunes Spreaker. Yep. Everything. everything. So uh, that's going to do it for the night of this is talking TV with Nick and Josh. I'm Josh. I'm Nick. <laughs> and I'm Jerome. Thanks for listening. <laughs>